Oh, thank you for the follow, Hungry Cosma. Thank you, thank you. No, don't install updates. No, GeoForce, no. You don't even install updates when I want you to. Why are you doing it now? No, bad boy. Oh. Romay at your service, Wink. Order and then in, 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 an introduction should not require any reaction from the crowd. The witness will refrain from wanton winking. Oh, yes, Your Honor. This is not good. She's already captured the heart of every man in this courtroom and some lesbians. <laughs> and then I laughed really hard at it. It seems that some of your friends have arrived. I love this game's, like, uncanny ability to zoom in at the best yeah, assets of certain characters. Like, bruh. Like, literally, like, they did the same thing to Ning Wong. They just, like, bruh, literally, like, right there in my face. I feel assaulted. So, like, lady, you and your, your mommy milkers needs to, like, stay six feet. Six feet! <laughs> now I can't use energy release! Really?! <laughs> Fucking Aubrey and your fucking love shit. Who even loves in this economy? In this economy? Who even loves? Does it even matter now? No. Uh, talk with the bounce. Okay, I'll talk with the bounce. All right. Um, am I a real? Am I? Am I a real VTuber father? Am I gonna finally get your love if I bounce enough? If I bounce enough and, and get your little ADHD brains going, will you will you sub? <laughs> if I do this, will I get more subs? <laughs> I keep on losing track. <laughs> the more movement is good. 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 <laughs> oh, I can get more. This is not bad falling away. Oh my god, that makes me think. Hey, Geeky, uh, I have a question. Have you... Hold on. Wait, Snack Snack, I have a question. Because, uh, Geeky, you probably uninstalled the game by now. Uh, what is the current state of Dead by Daylight right now? Is it still active? Because I, because I remember back around the time I was playing, people were complaining about a lack of, um... They, they claimed a hacker... Oh, I got sucked into it. Also, they were rage question, nice. bro. Yeah. Now that is your bread and butter. Uh, Flight, you can easily get that Bastion because literally he cannot move. You can sleep him, nade him, shoot him, and stuff. Oh, uh, cool. okay. Gotcha. I try. I try. Oh, they not on the Bastion. Oh, uh, never mind. Oh, I believe. PC. Damn. Oh, yeah. GG. We won that one. So easy. I'm a burger. You can't capture food. Duh. Oh. Alright, put that there. That needs to be on there. Nani? That also needs to be put here. Let me see. Why not? Oh, shiggy. I forgot to unmute and turn something on. Wow. <laughs> it's not like I was prepared or anything. Nah, nah, nah. Also, hello, Burns. Congrats on getting first. Hold on, I gotta throw on my, I gotta turn on my throwing system. I gotta turn it down. Hey, right, that looks about right. I don't know. And hey, close enough. Hey, yeah. Hell yeah. Nothing but the proest of moves. Listen, we're not known. <laughs> we're not known for streaming stuff. We're known for Yu-Gi-Oh's now. This, this is our life now. Yu-Gi-Oh's and Genshin. Hi, Raz. All right, first things first, we gotta get through the dailies. Da dailies, very important. Dailies is how you maximize the most uh, ways so you can pull Shunha. Which, by the way, you mean Genshin? This is Yu-Gi-Oh! It's gonna be Yu-Gi-Oh! in a second. Wait, wait, wait. Let it cook, birds. Let it cook. You're gonna see Yu-Gi-Oh! in a second. But first, I gotta make sure that this is done. Because this, to me, is very important. I gotta make sure I get, like, crafts constantly going for my teapot so I can raise my rank. But it will turn into Yu-Gi-Oh! in a moment, I assure you. Just, you know, gotta, 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 gotta keep the fifi up, you know what I mean? 
Gotta keep up the fui fui. And what's keeping up fui fui, you may ask? Uh, making sure stuff is constantly cooking. Constantly cooking. Um, I guess we'll get this? I don't know. I'm just getting whatever I haven't made yet. Alrighty, now we got that cooking. Let's get our daily minis. Make sure that doesn't get locked. Get our free, free friendship rank on these people in our teapot. And then... Yeah, let them cook. Exactly! See? Let it cook! Let it cook! Oops. I threw a sword. Alrighty, so, so, so. Uh, oh, yeah, mail. Who are we got mail? What's this? Greetings. Oh, Coco me sent me a thingy. I don't know what that's about, but I got the. Oh, a check in reward. What's this? That looks like pretty food, so I like it. Alrighty. Um. All right. So now, before we go forward, we're gonna we're gonna modify our deck a little bit yesterday, because it got me thinking. Uh, I think it was. Uh, Baba Choop, which brought up Duelic. Duelic is a freaking animal. He does eight pyro damage, and combined with Gravestone, you're screwed no matter which way you look at it. So I'm thinking, I'm sure there's a way to get Duelic, but cheaper. So I need to figure out how to go about this correctly. Um... Oh my gosh. Did I take away a card? I don't even know what I took away. Oh, they take away Catherine? Alrighty. Um. Nah, we'll go cancel. Alright, we're gonna make a new deck, except we're gonna change one of the people from Ganyu to Noel. So we're going to keep. We're gonna keep this one. Oh my god, should I add? I do want summons. <gasps> thank you for the bye, Aquaman! Thank you, thank you! One of these days I will come and actually be Yu-Gi-Oh! I actually do play Yu-Gi-Oh! on the Switch. So actually, this one of these days this can be Yu-Gi-Oh! This can't be Genshin! This is Yu-Gi-Oh! Genshin Edition! See? Oh, thank you for the hydrate, by the way. But see, I told you, just let it cook! A second past it's Genshin. <laughs> See, it's Yu-Gi-Oh's now, but right now, um, I'm trying to, uh... Here's the thing, the main deck that I play with is a deck list you can find online. But I'm trying to learn how to build a deck on my own that'll suit my play style. And, um, right now it's like, I'm trying to figure out... I don't want to rely on deck builds all the time, but they're a good way to learn how to build decks and see what's important. All I see is Genshin. Right right now, you, you don't you see the quads? Look at the quads! Also not playing the game yet, so we're in quad building mode. Afro Man, tell Burns why this is Yu-Gi-Oh! <laughs> you have the best character design on Twitter? Thank you! <laughs> I appreciate that, Taylor Swift. Look at me, I'm per I'm the perfect specimen. <laughs> I am peak human. <laughs> I am peak human. This is what talent looks like. <laughs> okay, so with this deck we want Noelle to be the star. So we're going to get give her the meaty sword. Um let me see. I don't know if we'll need that, but I'll throw that in there because right now we're trying to feel we're trying to feel out. We're probably gonna want Lula Harbor. We're going to want Timmy's. Two Timmy's. Um, we're probably gonna want a Helen. What is this do? Mm, the way to draw cards. I want people to have energies. We want a way to be draw power. I want this. Mm, what's this? Switch weapon card. Shift artifact. Um. I do want my units to live longer. 
Um, let's see. We're gonna need this in case shit goes bad. Um, we're gonna need a bag of food. Oh, a way to get alts off. Is she is. Maybe I don't. I want another defense food. Let's see if we can buy another defense food. Because I feel like we're going to need defense food to, like, live out any bad caca that's coming our way. Which I hopefully I think we have enough coins to get it. I might have made myself broke going for the fancy Ganyu card, but it's okay. We can just try our best. It's Yu-Gi-Oh! because it's time to... See? See? See, Burns? Afro-Man can't be wrong! I like Afro-Man! Look, see? L listen! Listen to Afro-Man! He knows what's up! He knows you gee when he sees it. You look fruity as fuck, you dumb bitch. You just don't be mad because you're walking around with a yee ass haircut. <laughs> you probably get some bitches on your dick if you... <laughs> you know the thing. <laughs> don't be mad because I'm beautiful. <laughs> don't be mad. Yes, I see the cards. They're Genshin. No, it's Yu-Gi-Oh now. Alright, so I want defense food. Because this uh, deck has... Uh, it has healing. Well, let's see if it has enough healing. I doubt it, but we'll, we'll try it out. Let's see. Where's the food? Do I want this one? When this character uses a skill or equips a talent. Hmm. Do I want that? You know what? Yes! I... no. Uh. Hmm. One can... Spend one less Geo die. Spend one less Geo die. Just is cheaper. Hmm. How much is the food card? Oh, it's here. All right. Let's look at the other foods. Uh, next attacks cost less. How many is it? Next three normal attacks. Um. All right. So this is the defense food. Cost one less heals. Right, so we're gonna want one defense food plus one damage. Ooh. Hmm. Hey. Okay. How you doing, ducks? Uh, you know the new PlayStation version two goes for. Wait a minute. New the new PlayStation VR two. You mean like the VR headset? stuff for PlayStation? What are they doing charging that? That don't make sense. That don't make sense at all. Why? Who wants to buy for the normal version? Nevertheless, pay up the up the fleet fleet for, a, for a newer one. I'm gonna be honest, I barely know people who do VR. The only people who do VR are the sus weird people. And you know who I talk about when I say the sus weird people. We're talking about you VR chat ERP or weirdos. The that, that, that. Sussy. Sussy. Alright, maybe instead I'll put in um, defense food. What's this? What is her ultimate burst again? Ooh, I might be worth actually getting, um, this. I don't know, I might replace this with a food card, but we'll see. Um. Alright, see if we can modify this Ganyu deck too. I feel like we don't need this. Um. Uh, la la. We can probably use um fixing the summons in here because this is also summon based. All right, all right. So let's try out the card in the real world or in the overworld, so we can get coins and also try out on a little bit harder difficulty on PCs. Or, I'm sorry, NPCs. Yeah, I've made up my mind 
uh, I'm going for sh to pull for Shen, huh? Yeah, I remember we talked about it. Um, at first he said you wouldn't, but the thing is, about I looked up what Shen, huh, really does. And Shen, huh, is, um, as a new player, I don't really understand all the new terminology. But the way people have described, um, uh, Shen, huh, she's a good way to boost your attack. Not only just for cryo people, but for other elements too. So she's a, she's a good buffer, is the word that I've heard described. So, um, I'm gonna definitely be pulling for her, just because I feel like she'll be very helpful for Spiral Abyss. Um, which will be pretty nice. Um, so I'm gonna definitely be saving my- I know a lot of people are saying skip everybody, but I really hope I get Shinha. Because one, Shinha's the reason why I stayed in Genshin. I came for the Dendro Daddy, stayed for the beautiful opera that was uh, all about Shinha. Um... So, I'm gonna definitely be pulling- are you guys gonna be pulling for Shenha when the banner comes up? Also, you know, it's kind of funny. I thought a lot of people liked Ayaka, and a lot of people don't. <laughs> and I thought it was just me. It's like, bruh. <laughs> I'm kind of glad I'm not the only one that kind of finds her med. V VR is very niche. Yeah, it is. She's too mommy to pass up. Um, a uh, Afro Man. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm stuck at work, but have my lurk. Thank you, Pixel. Sorry that you're at work. I will dedicate this hopeful, hopefully, victory uh, to you. John Cena, the ultimate sussy person, was. She was talking about. He's allowed to be sus. I don't know. He's allowed to be sussy. If there's someone that's allowed to be sussy, it's John Cena. And you can't tell me otherwise. You cannot tell me otherwise. I've seen people not like her. Yeah. This is a big tell. Yeah, it is, Ray. Also, thank you for the lark. Wow. This is not the role. This is not the role, Queen. Try again. Wow. So this is Kaka. Do I even have enough for Goba? All right, so first we need Jade Palace immediately. Because literally none of these roles work for her. Oh, I need, I need Fifi. Mm, so we're gonna instead sack that. Mm. Ah, oh, we'll sack this. No, no, yes, no, yes, no, yes, no, no, yes. I have to make a choice because my rolls were so caca. I have to sack one of these cards to get a flame die. Alright, so. Spend less. Or get. Yeah, this. Yeah, yeah. That, that's temporary. She, Helen's more permanent. Because we need to summon Goba to get shit going. And then we will switch, and then we can do uh, at least a normal attack. With what's her face? Alright, so we're gonna switch her out. Ah, I don't wanna sack any more cards. Mm. Yeah, let's get attacking. Yeah, yeah. I wish I could do a grass attack so we can get our summon, uh, we can get our loop going, but it's literally not in the dice. But thanks to the Jade Palace, it will be. Thanks to the Jade Palace, it will be. This is why this card's so important. When you have Kaka luck the way I started out with. Oh, that was Kaka. But yes, Holy Burns, it's now Yu-Gi-Oh! This is now Yu-Gi-Oh! Dang, Oba! All right, Queen. Oh, perfect. Oh, we got Paimon, so now it don't even matter if we mess up, really. Uh, Kaka dice. Okay, better. Much better. Alright, so first thing we're gonna do is we're going to play Helen. No! Not though! I need those Geo dice! Alright, so we're gonna have to instead um, play this one. Because we need all our dice. Alright. We're gonna be a sneaky kaka. No! No! Why? Why must you dip? Hold on, wait a minute, hold on. 
How much dice? Okay, I'll sacrifice one of my- Don't let it auto-choose for you, or it's gonna pick, like, wait. Play this one first. This one. Stop picking, like, my important dice! Stop it! Go home! You're drunk! Alright, we're gonna sacrifice one of our multi-plants. Steal that. And then do this! Alrighty. Can I do anything? No. Alright, so we're gonna switch to Noelle. And we're gonna use this on Goba. To make him stay one more time. Perfect! That way they're both- they're both even with both summons. Okay. And then Noelle can get working! I believe she works the same way in the game, where if you're shielded and attack, you get to, um, heal our people. So, hopefully that is- Dang, Goba! You are scary. Dang! How many monsters do you got? <laughs> where are these monsters coming from? <laughs> like, literally. All right. This can be better. I don't want to sack any more cards. I actually need them. <sighs> we'll see if we'll need to sack Timmy. But first, we're going to do this. We got shield points. Alright, now let me see if I understand this correctly. Alrighty, so I guess only, I guess... Hmm. So I guess she might not. I really wish my dice rolls were better. I'd be able to do so much more if I didn't get majority chakra. And I kind of- I kind of need my cards here to- Oh well. Let's just hit them with a normal attack and call it a day. Hopefully next round we'll get better dice and we're not gonna get screwed. Because so far we've been getting kind of reamed by our own dice. I know, right? Just like in the actual game. But on the positive side, our um, our summons are doing the work while my, our dice are situating themselves out. Alright, so we have a fodder card. I'm half debating to play it or not, just to guarantee even... Okay. We won't need to... Okay. It's better to not have doubles. So this is much better. So we're gonna do this first. Alright. We're gonna hit for everything. Now, sweeping time. I need to learn how her abilities work, I'm gonna be honest. Maybe it doesn't work the way I thought it did. <laughs> um... Let's play another Jade Palace just to be safe. Because these do stack. And uh, I've been having really bad luck. I need to be able to do stuff with Noel. Damn. What, no more slimes? Oh, now we get the freaking Liwa Harbor! Fuck you, bruh. We don't need you, Liwa Harbor. Oh, it doesn't even- oh, see? Double Jade Palace? If you can, and you don't have anything else, do it. I believe in the heart of the cards. Hell yes! Hi, Ali! That is the best feeling, I'm not gonna lie.
I guess this doesn't have healing the way I thought it did. Let's test something out real quick because I am very curious. Because I thought... I thought... Maybe it's only when she has her character card out. We might need to read and do more uh, research. Maybe I didn't understand the way I thought it did. Let me just end it and read her card. Because we already won, but that was not... That was not the most clean. That, that was very messy. That was very messy indeed. Alright, if it doesn't work the way I think it, it does, then I'm gonna put way more food into it. Alright. I'm surprised we never got a character card. Alright, what does her character card do? <clears throat> ah, okay. So only when she has her character card equipped does her shit heal. But alone, she won't. So that means we're lacking healing. So... We gotta make a choice here. Um... We gotta make a choice. Do we switch out this one for Bennett? But we sacrifice one of our summons, which makes this deck complete. You know what? You know what? Let's try something a little different. So maybe this isn't this isn't the tea. Maybe this isn't the tea. Maybe summons. I mean, it helps, but like that's not the point of this deck. That is scuffed as. Frick. I need to level up this battle pass. For me, I've been playing a little bit offline, so I know we'll get into it eventually, but you have a lot of time to beat the battle pass. Alright. So, we want Noel to have good setup. Let me see. This one she heals, but it is for... She heals and shields. Hmm. Good. This one. Bennett. He heals. So we can put him in here. But he usually barely reaches his ult in time. Hmm. I'm trying to figure it out here. This one. Hmm. Let's mess around with this because um I am unsure. Because the problem is, is that I I I I tried the Barba Ningguang and this one. I don't know. It just does not suit me. But then that doesn't make Noelle the star. It makes... Hmm. hmm. Problem with this one is that she needs three instead of two to deal her star. So this would be f ice, fire, and this one. <gasps> he heals, though. And he's a two. Mm. Okay, okay, okay. So, so Sing Chu heals with his. No, no, I don't think he does. Or does he? Maybe that's only his character card, just like freaking Noel. Who's it here? Uh, Rain Sword. Once there's a tribute rainstorm. Oh, it just adds one more sword? Is that what I'm understanding? Oh, it just decreases damage. No. I keep confusing the actual character with the cards. Um, Not a lot of self-sustain, so we're going to probably have to put a lot of food into here just to, like, keep it up. Yeah. So instead... 
because I want Noel to like I want them to be weakened by the summons and then Noel comes in and just thick daddies all over them. Um Okay, so instead the gravestone. Ooh! This'll be good. Oh no, it's elemental skill. No, no. This one. Normal attack. Okay. Cause we need we need self-sustain in this place. Let's get Wangshu Harbor, even though we never saw it last game. Which kinda sucks, but you know, that's kind of it's kind of the luck you get sometimes. We're gonna get the food bag, get that. Raw power. Um Okay, maybe instead of that, we'll do the crane comes home. Or do we? Yeah. Um. Alright, so we're gonna need food, and quite a bit of it. So we want two defense foods and two hash browns. What's this? Oops, almost spilled my water. Um. The next three normal attacks cost less. Alright, we're gonna wanna fix the summons. We got a food bag. Um. Let's see. And then. What's. Oh. Gotta figure out. Ah, yes! We need this, definitely. Mm. Do I need two cranes? Mm, maybe we don't. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we'll, have put, we'll put one and put two of these. It's always good to get alt stuff from places. Um, maybe move it down to one. Ash brown. And then, what's this? Uh, yes. Good way to get some ult charge quickly off the bat. Okay. Okie dokie. I, I feel like we don't need these character cards. Let's see. Actually, no. We'll, 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 we'll need that. We'll need that. And we'll need... Alright. So now that I understand the rules... Let's try... Let's try now. I don't get it unless I play with you. Genshin got me hooked. Same. Same. The only time I, I put more time into Overwatch is um, probably on the weekend. When I'm able to just, you know, hang out with the friends. You know what I mean? Oh, maybe I can add that official. Alright, good hand, good hand, good hand. Alright. So I guess until we get no one else character card, let's just assume there's no healing. And with the luck we had last game, we have to assume we'll never get it. Which is a safe bet. Alright, so let's throw down the Timmy. Let's throw down our Wangshu Harbor. Our Liwa Wharf Harbor. This helps us get more cards for the next two cards. Two additional cards for the next two turns. Put down our food bag. Good ult food. Alrighty, we're gonna summon Boba. Ooh, she's gonna hurt because she's fire and I'm electrified due to the stupid field hard thing. Oh, oh, never mind. Well, screw you, I'm switching. You ain't getting a free elemental charge off me just because you're BS. Hell no. I see through you. What's your name? I, I, ya, yo, I Mia. I see through you. Ho. You're not gonna, you're not gonna put fire against my ass. 
Ow! Oh, her thing hurts because she has the raven bow and the witch hat. All right. All right, sweet. All right, so we're definitely putting down a Liwa uh, uh, Jade Palace just to help with our rolling ability. Ooh. That's actually pretty decent, but we need at least some grasses. Or that works too. I, I'm, I'm, I am happy. I am not mad from that. Oh. Okay. Well, we got four switched. So we're going to. Um... Switch back to. Hmm. Let me do the math here. It's not worth. We're gonna switch to this one. God, you're adding all kinds of artifacts to everyone. A defense food! Alright. Alright, defense food. And they have a, whatchamacallit. Oh, what a predicament. Um... I am nowhere near what I need. Alright, so we're just gonna... Give another dot on our guy. Switch over. Give her a, a, a dot to attack with. And uh, move on. Because it's kind of annoying we got four switched. Alrighty. So we're just going to give her a dot. Yeah. That's it. All right, now we get the Noel card. Cool, cool, cool. We're gonna definitely need to play um, our hash browns at some point on our part, play, just to make sure she sees the light of day. Uh, these cat guys can go away. Thank you. Very much better. That we could easily shift into Noel. Why does he get to switch all the time? Alright, so we're gonna use our hash browns on Kalei, just to give her a chance at life. We're going to use this to borrow. And then we're gonna- Ooh, we're gonna get Dendro reaction! Elliot! Ooh, we got Quicken. And Quicken... Did you let your dendro damage? You get plus one. Eh. Could be better, I suppose. Um. So we're gonna now switch to Noel, and now our ability is going to uh, help heal Pipo. Let's just use this real quick, clone. Alright, now we're he being a healer. But we can't do anything because we ran out of dice, so... But, we now have our, uh, Fleefleas to do the work. Do we have anything to play? No. Oh, so luckily we got this food, so we can keep a constant flow of food going. Ouchie, poo, poo Heck yeah! Heck yeah! Alright, oh, they get to start first? Frick. That's fine. That is fine, I suppose. Hi, Stanium! Wanana! Lily! Alright. Oh, we got our Claymore! Oh, you're, go you're screwed. You're ten ways screwed to Sunday. 
Our girl's got her sword. And we're gonna give her an additional bit of sustain. What do we? All right, let's just make sure we read her stuff. When I create a full plate. All right. What does this do? Normal attack, so not yet. Not yet. Do a breastplate. Not much I can do right now, so we're going to... But we're gonna give him one more chance at life. And... I go first the next round? Okay, I wasn't sure if they ended or not. Um... Now, let's save our food for now. Let's save our food for now. Alright, cool, cool, cool. Heck yeah. Oofy doodle, like... Uh, the swirl is annoying. Maybe we'll take out the crane. We don't need the crane. We'll add something else with more use. Omni dice, I like that. Hello, what is up? Rickshin and Dippy! Hey, yo, Dippy! Alright, so we're going to. Oh, the problem is. Ooh. Girl. Girl. All right, time to hit hard. Noel ain't messing around no more. All right, so we can we have enough we have enough of cards to use to um switch over. Let's use this to heal everyone. Use this to hit hard. I will not have enough to. Mm. We'll probably switch this one out for a Helen. I feel like a Helen would be very useful here. Alright, so, I think I know a card to switch out, but... Mm. Ah, okay. Let's just hit him hard. Let's just hit him really hard. You didn't fall for it this time? For what? What did I fall for? What was I supposed to have fallen for? I'm confused. <laughs> Let's defend Kole just so she don't get her ass for knights knocked out. Because that swirl is going to mess us up. That swirl is going to mess us up something awful. Hi, Darky Devil. Welcome back. Long time no see. Oh, I think we got it just from our summons alone, though. Yep. Cheeky. Cheeky summons. Very cheeky. I don't know, the Noel deck is still a little weird. It is, it is, it is still weird. The name?
huge wreck. Ah! I get it! I didn't get it. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest. I didn't get it. Because one, I don't know how to read. <laughs> like, that's not, you're not the first person whose, like, funny name has gone unnoticed or un, un, like, seen. There's two names that's gone in the Hall of Fame for me not noticing. There's this one guy called Chronic Math Debater. And I didn't know that that was supposed to be Chronic Masturbator. I just thought he really liked math. And the second one was actually re very recently with your local idiot, but it's spelled in Lee. And instead of me calling him idiot or seeing that it says local idiot in Lee, I called him Cal. <laughs> that's the only part I could read. <laughs> so you're not the first person whose funny name I'm <laughs> I can't read. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Whoopsie poopsie. <laughs> well, we learned something today. All right. So maybe Noelle might not be the tea for... Maybe... I don't know. Noelle doesn't fit like... I don't know. I feel like the problem is... Is that I need her to heal. And maybe I need to fit her with somebody else. But you know who I think would go good with this? Fischl. Yeah, official. So, my only concern, because these all have summons, but my only concern is, um, that squishy-ish? Mona has summons too, but I don't know. I don't get her. I'm gonna be real. Like, I don't, I don't understand the papas. Um, uh, when dealing with Skill damage, remove this. I don't get it. I don't get this card. Mona, she's fine. I, I, just like I don't get her actual character in the game, I don't get her in card form. Remove this status. And double damage dealt. For this instant. Hmm. Mm. I am unsure. Mm. I do like Fischl more. Um. Let's see. Put that down there. Do that. That bow. Take away the crane. Um, take that away. Mm. Add two Catherines, because switching around will be important. Mm. And maybe this. Shift around your weapons from one character to another. Hmm. Hmm. Eh. I feel like just adding another hash browns would be fun. Maybe I have too many defense foods. Maybe I should just crack it back down to one. Maybe maybe I shouldn't be have going overboard overboard on the food. Um. Let's see. One other one of these. Mm. Character switches and does not have an energy added. Okay, you can add both of these. All right, all right. Let me just rename it from Noel to I don't know official. Uh, deck name summon. Oh, caps summons. That all right. Let's try one more here. Let's fight this guy person. All right, so. Both sides are affected by pyro. Okay. Works good for me, I suppose. Put away that food card. We don't need that. The Catherine's a good start, though. 
Uh, why? <laughs> so it says here that when the action phase begins, both sides are going to be affected by Pyro. So we're going to start off with this one. Because both sides are going to start off with Pyro. Okay. Not the best start. We now need to be looking out for electric and fire. Slightly better. Alright. So we're gonna put in a Catherine. We're going to immediately get a, a free summon from the elemental reaction alone, which is good. I'm by me home slice. Um, this is bad. Well, I guess we could use this to. Hmm. I guess we'll just switch over, I suppose. do anything else. I'm kind of screwed. Oh, I love that here. So I guess we'll just end and end, let him do his thing. I'm not giving him the free electrical uh, charge off Cole. Alright. Oh, wow. We're getting, we've been getting like nothing but doubles. It's been like double city all day. Alright, Kaka rolls. Not gonna help me. Um... Wow! Super Kaka rolls not gonna help me. That's fine. Luckily we have enough doubles to help us out, I guess. So... Throw that out. And use this... To get a free Oz. Jesus, they hit hard. Switch over to this one. I have enough cards to sacrifice to get an um, Fifui. So we're gonna turn this into fire. <sighs> you gotta do what you gotta do, or do I attack? Nah, we'll just attack, because he's about to elemental my ass to Kingdom Come. Alright. And we end. Oh yeah, next one he's done. Unless he has more cards, no, more samurai hiding in the background. Again, Kaka. Well, no, nah, no, nah, we got decent ish. Now that is good. That that is good. Doesn't matter though. Guy's at one health. He's like literally on the verge of death. We we so. What is it to me? I'll just do this for fun, just to see her ult. I never see her ult. Alrighty. Oh, there are more samurai. Well then. Well then. I look like a dupe. So we're definitely switching to... No. Okay, so there's more samurai. So they get to attack first. That's fine. See what with the hair? Are you supposed to be some type of anime protagonist? If you don't know where this hair comes from, 
I I apologize for your lack of culture. <laughs> this hair is literally iconic. Oh, this is such caca rolls. These rolls very not iconic. But this hair very iconic. And if you don't know, you don't know. And it's okay not to know. Oh, force switch. You love to see it. Uh, well. Wow! All right. So, what do I sacrifice? Sacrifice the burst food. Yay! Like, this is not good. This is not good because all of this is leaning towards fire, and this girl too low to do anything. Um, and I don't have enough to summon Oz, so. So we're gonna use a hash browns on her and call it a, a good. The burning field will take care of them. So far we're getting nothing but doubles this game and our dice have not been helping either. Alright, so for here... Oh. So Jade Palace is MIA. Shut the fire. We need some electric. Wow. Or more fire. Or more fire. That helps too. Truth be told. This is why we luckily we got this card. Alright. Let me just read my card, make sure I understand. Official creep bombs. Make sure I understand correctly. When your Fischl who has this card equipped creates an Oz, and after Fischl use. Alright, so we need to create Oz. Ooh. Yeah, we definitely do. I'm gonna have to sack this character. I activate Pot of Greed, which allows me to draw coup cards. Thank you, Banhammer. Oh! Why did she get hit? What did she get hit? Oh, he got powered. Damn. Well. You know what? You know what? We gotta do what we gotta do. Excuse <laughs> We're just unlucky this game. The world's most unlucky. Like, literally the world's most unlucky. <laughs> I think it's done because of the our summons, but we'll see. Yep. God dang, though, I did not meet the battle requirements. Or did I? Oh, never mind, I did! Most of the time, the chat- the objectives have been have two characters be up. Dang, but that- that just- we were just unlucky from the dice from beginning to end. I- I have two Jade Palaces in there. But they just refused to come out at any point. Like, we got two Catherines. We drew in most of our food, which is unusual. We never drawn. I've yet to see this card ever show its frickin' face. So that's just a case of unlucky. Like, very unlucky. <laughs> but oh well. We be like that sometimes. Alright, now are there any more people to fight? In this place. No? Other people here? Nope. Alright. So let's see what's on the agenda today. 
Alrighty, so we're gonna let's start burning some resin. So, um, whose stuff is available today? Okay. Pardon me. Oh, that reminds me. Okay. So I'm gonna make a change here to my team again. I don't know why. This fourth slot has been the bane of my existence. I I I, I need an archer. But you know who I've been fe he, he does really good damage. But you know who I've been feeling I want to put in his place even more? This one. Like, I don't know why. Like, she's gonna- uh, Official is gonna definitely empower Kaching to do constant thing of damage. Since Kaching, when, whenever people are affected by Electro, she does more damage. So we're going to... Also, she's like C5. So I think I might rather have her instead. Hey, Spear Doom! Heck yeah. If you go to the event tab, it tells you which ones. True, but I want to see if I need it. If I don't need anything, then I'm not going to bother. So let's switch out all of these for, um, child. Um, I should probably look up what she needs. <laughs> okay, <clears throat> so I'm going to probably build her as like a support DPS, I guess, in a way. So let me look up what the internet claims is correct to build Fischl. And if ever you don't know how to build a character and no, you don't know what to get uh, uh, for a character, just look online. There's like these awesome charts that show you how to build her as a main DPS or as a sub DPS, what weapons to use on her and who she works well with. And also the best weapon sets if you're a free to play player or if you're a paid player. Okay. But how you doing, Spear? All right. So luckily she does work well with Kaching, of course. Um, it says here that the best sets are two gladiator and two chivalry. I don't have any chivalry, but I'm willing to grind for it if there's no nothing else to get for her. Um, I need to level her up, actually, ASAP, because she's still stuck at 70. I gotta ascend her! So, if I don't need to level up anything else for her... What does she need? She does need books, and I'm trying to figure out what this book is. Um... Oh my god, I gotta open it up in like a bigger tab, I can barely see that picture. It looks like a harp book. So let's see if there's, um, if Harp is available today. If not, we're just gonna do non-stop Electro, I guess. So let's take a look at the domains available today. Let me see. The game also shows you substats. I know, but I don't care about that. Because nine times out of ten, people go for freaking crit. So I don't, I, when it comes to, like, the way I want to build, I ignore it. Like, literally, like, nine times out of ten, it's gonna be crit rate, and then crit. It's it's just crit. There's no point in looking at it for me personally, because it does not go for my situation. Um, valid, yeah. Because literally, Genshin people and how they like the the top, top, the top. Uh, they they literally AFK brain crit, and I'm like, that's not how I want to build her. I'm not trying to make her a DPS. <laughs> Uh, let me see. I don't think there's I don't think there's wind book available. Or harp book. Let me see. Uh Oh, it is harp book. How convenient. I have 16 already. Alright. Yeah. Uh, that's today. Oh, the game? Oh, yeah, I read that. That would be shocking. <laughs> shocking. <laughs> I get it. Oh, let me take off this hair so people don't get the wrong way. Okay. Um, so, um... Does anyone want to join to burn some resin? If not, that's okay. I can do it on my own at a lower level. But if people want to join, let me know. There is I did it. There is I did it today. Damn what? 
Hey yo, call me. What is good? What is good? Let me actually switch around her weapon as well. And see how this goes. Um, switch out her weapon. For the good one. There we go. It says here that it's good with Gladiator. I want to die. Why? That's not good. Dying is generally frowned upon in most societies. <laughs> so why would you want to do that? Uh, do I even? I don't think I have anything from that set. Mm. I guess I kind of do. Um, most of the stuff it asks for, I do not have. But that is okay. Because we're just going to do these. Ah, oh, this only works if it's like a four set, I'm gonna be honest. There's no point in a two set. Alright, so I guess in the meantime, uh, because I'm more looking for something up for the midterm, but we're just going to... Um, oh my god, I guess... Um, mm, mm, Oh, I'm gonna have to do some major shakeups. All right. So we're actually gonna give this from Kaching because it's better that her lecture damages more instead of Kaching's. All right. And then we're gonna give her. What do child have? Uh, elemental Mastery. Okay. She'll definitely need Elemental Mastery, I think. I'm not sure. I'm gonna be deadass honest. Um, because the stuff I have, none of the lists want. Because right now I'm going for set bonuses more than, like, stats. If the stats don't match, then I won't put it on her, but... We're going to... Anything give Lightning? No. This is going to be a tough call. Mm. Uh, how you doing, Banshee? Hello, hello. Twitch recommended me. Ayo. We're, we, 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 I'm going for an all vaporized team. What does vaporize do as far as elemental reactions goes? What does odds damage based off of? Actually, that's a very valid question. I probably should have looked at that first. Deals electro damage. Just electro damage. That's it. Um, however, I don't have all the artifacts. I, I would love to have the full set of this, but I can't because one, we're not at that stage yet where we can farm for the perfect stats for the perfect artifact because I'll never be able to reach endgame. The first thing I want to do is at least get sets that are passable for me to get to endgame. And then when, um, when I'm at the end and there's nothing else, then I can start farming and focusing and praying for the right uh, artifacts. Because at this point in the game, I cannot afford to like... If I, if I were to stop and farm for the perfect artifacts, I'd be here and never leave Inazuma. But I want to leave Inazuma and get to Sumeru because one, there's stuff. There's a lot of stuff I want to do with Sumeru. B, I want to I want to level up and play with Dendro Daddy, and I also want to farm for that glass bottle pet. So yeah, my. Oh yeah, no, yeah, for sure. Like for example, um, Noel, uh, I build her very defense heavy because when she alts, she turns that defense and puts it into attack. And it's, she's a, she's a, she hits like a truck truck, you know what I mean? Like, like Noelle, like her ship scales off a of defense when she ults, and it's really great. But as far as fish, not, as far as fish is concerned, um, ah, uh, I, the, we got the two main stuff that we need, but it's the off stuff. 
that I'm trying to figure out what to give her because... <sighs> do I build her as just attack or do I build her? Because I don't have a recommended stuff. But yeah, do you also play uh, Genshin Banshee? And also, who's your team? I tried farming for artifacts and got absolutely nothing. The thing is, with farming for artifacts, you're going to be doing that forever. And literally, that's only for endgame people. And I am not an endgame people yet, so I can't do that. Yeah, I know. Armpit scales off with HP. That's good. That's good. MA. Wait. What was that? What was that? <laughs> I don't understand what that said. <laughs> um, so I guess in the meantime... Um, I guess we'll just give her more energy recharge. I don't, I don't know. Um, let's just give her this troop set, I guess. Let's just give her this troop set to give her the... What does Elemental Mastery do again? I'm trying to remember. And I cannot... I cannot remember. Actually, no, we're gonna go with the Martial Arts set. I changed my mind. If I have enough to give her two, I hope. But now we're gonna have to mess with Kaching. I don't wanna hand that. Because I want something passable. Oh, I don't want something that gives her HP. I want attack, but... Oh, these are such shitty stats. Alright, so we'll steal this. Sometimes blue's better if your top stat sucks. She reminds me of Maple Machine Gun Forum. From I don't want to... Wait. She reminds me of Maple Machine Gun Forum. From I don't want to get hurt anime. Oh, gun for- god form! Ah! I saw a tank and my first thought was M1A2 Abrams a tank, maybe I messed up the name. I have no idea what that is, so I think other people might know, but my world's very small, so I'm not sure. Hmm. You know what? I'm just gonna up her ability to just be a bow user. That's it, so I'm just gonna go with the troop thing and say fuck it. Fuck it, I don't care. Or... Well, first let's mess with Kaching, see what we gave her instead. So, we're going to instead give her a full ass gladiator set. So, that's what we're gonna do. Um, what does the internet say that she should have? Hold on, let me look at it first, and then I'll consult with the internet. Because, uh, let me see, Kaching DPS build. Let's see, what does the internet think I should have? Open up a new tab. Alright. It says... Gladiator and Thunder Fury. So, just because for the lack of the stuff I can't share, so... We're just gonna make her full Gladiator. Just give her straight up like crazy attack. We're just gonna make her attacks crazy. Um mm, no, that's there's wait that's way too much defense. Oh, I can't justify that. Can't justify that at all. Um Alright, so here. She. Oh! Alright, so I'm going to need one more piece. Or do I? Only I had more of you. All right, so the headpiece stays because it has crit rate, um, which is what we need for her. Not. 
There we are. Now for the last bit, what are we gonna give her instead? Let's see what else we got here. Hmm. Give this to her. Do we have enough to do double this? Oh, wrong thing. I don't want that. That's for Blizzard. No, we want Thunder. Hey, Ranger. What is up? Hello, hello. Um, hi, Ninja as well. Oh my god. Hello. I didn't see that. I'm so sorry. Good question. Um, from what I understand, elementary mastery from the little bit that I've seen, it like empowers your elemental reactions. So, like, if you want, like, if you, if you're purely, like, for example, with Rose, you're purely vaporized, your vaporize will do more damage, from what I understand. Oh, so hi, Jizdu! Ooh. Ooh. I, I, you want to ref- I don't know what you're saying. <laughs> I don't know what you're saying. <laughs> I'm gonna be real. All right, so. Well, this kind of sucks. This whole shakeup means that ka -ching's, uh, freaking shit's all at zero. <laughs> because I've been doing quite a bit of, of, of a lot of shakeups to my people lately. Um. Well, how's it going? Alright, so we're gonna do these. I don't need the feather. I don't need a flower. This will do. There we go. And then here we do. Shocking, I have nothing that gives Electro. It's all Geo and Dendro. I'm working with what I got because I am low level. And not the end game. It's best to work with what you got than waste time hating yourself getting crack 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 crap. Because I'm not at that point where I should be worrying about that. I just want a workable set because I'm still working out the team I want to play with. Because I keep switching up people and stuff keeps shifting around. Official's better physical damage. I'm not really- I'm not really using her for her main physical damage. I'm mostly there for her to throw out her Oz and power up Kaching. That- that is what I want. Because I plan- shit. I plan for these artifacts to last me all the way to Samiru. So I can just AFK go forward and level everything up. Oh. Uh. uh. We are all growing webbed toes for independent- why is there a flood when we move? Elemental mastery affects elemental reactions specifically. Certain characters use the stat more than others, so it's good to know which one needs it more. Thank you! That's what I thought, Night nice Sage! Thank you, thank you! I appreciate that. Yeah, yeah! Or at least that's how I built her. Well, that's- the, the point isn't for her to be on the stage very long. The point for her is to throw out Oz and then Kaching comes in and does most of the work. Oh! Why am I lagging? I don't know why I'm lagging, I'm gonna be honest. Like, random lag spikes because, yay. Uh, I, I, mm. I'll be honest. I'll wait till it, like, calms down, I guess. I don't know why I'm not doing anything different, it's just, you know. Oh, is it because I have, oh. I think I know what it is. I think I know what it is. <laughs> oh my god. No, because at this point there's really nothing I have. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna farm for artifacts at this point. Unless it's something I already have. Yeah. I'm not gonna farm for anything because there's no point right now. I want something that's passable for the story. Which luckily I don't need much to go through the story. It just needs to be leveled up and at least have fun sets to deal with. Um, but I am wi I'm willing to listen. But if it involves farming, then I'll just say no. Nah. Because I see what online they already say, and yeah, I can't tell if it's fixed or not. <laughs> I like it. Just talk until someone says it's fixed. 
Alrighty. So, oh, I can go there actually. But yeah, I'm willing. I don't, I don't know. Let me lower the bit rate. Maybe that'll help. Let's see. Let me see here. Maybe this will help? I'm not downloading porn. <laughs> it's just, I don't know, random times. Internet is used up and I can't, I can't explain. I can't explain. I lowered the bit rate. It might look a little, little not the best, but it's fine. I'd rather have it be a little fee fee than la la. There we are. I'd lower the bit rate a little bit, but you know, at least it's it's working. Hopefully, I'm gonna cry in the corner with my artifact on. <laughs> That's another reason why I don't want to bother farming because I'm gonna be here forever, um, uh, farming for stuff instead of you know playing the game. And I want to play the game. <laughs> Huh? No. The, here's the thing. You don't need to have the most optimal artifacts to go through the world uh, without lowering your world rank. I can go through my world fine with my current artifacts as long as they're leveled up. That's not the issue. You don't need to go optimal to low and uh, uh, you don't need to go optimal to go through the story normally. You just gotta build for what you. I hate these dendro things. They're so annoying. I'm gonna, I'm gonna bother. I'm just gonna go where I'm going. What do you mean? Things are already easy for me. That nothing's hard. It's just people want me to optimize, and I'm like, no. I'm not gonna waste my time. Uh, my artifacts are serviceable enough. Why are you talking about lowering my world? I don't need to lower my world. My world is perfectly doable. That's why I'm confused. Why do I got why do I gotta lower my world? Explain. When I can go through my world perfectly fine with what I already have. I wanna I wanna hear the explanation. I hear the grade A um whatchamacallit. I'm not gonna do abyss. If I do Abyss, it's for funsies, but the point for me is not play Abyss, so next. Doesn't matter what point I'm at. You happen to have an Electro Damage Bonus Artifact Goblet? Then put that on ka -ching. It's self-infused with Electro and has low cooldowns. I'm gonna put that on Fischl. So, so we summon Oz, and Oz will do all the damage while, uh, well, maybe. I already, I already have that. I already been doing that for ka -ching, but I gotta test out this new... I gotta test out how everybody moves together. I might switch it back. Though, depending how it works. Lower, lower. Why do I. It's. N the, the world's not hard. I was gonna say that. Why are you guys saying the lower. I know it makes things easier, but nothing's hard. Like your damage bonus goblet. Thing really isn't optimized, it's just suggestion. Yeah, I already do, and I put it on official. I put on Fischl so I can get more damage through Oz, but if it doesn't work through Oz, I'm gonna put it back on Kaching. Cause that's what I was already doing. Because I'm still trying to figure out how this team works together. Like Noel and uh, Noel and uh, Ning Wong works perfectly together, and uh, Kaching worked good with Child, but I'm unsure with Fischl. You aren't getting stuff through the story. Hmm. Aren't you getting stuff just to get through the story? Yeah? Well, based on what you're saying, it was rougher to get- No, it's not. I never said the story was hard to get through. I'm just getting stuff together so I can go through it, like, easily. Because what I was doing before is that I was doing shit um, in Inuzuma while I was still level 60. You can't do that. All I'm doing is just bringing stuff up to date. And nothing- none of my artifacts were leveled at all. Like, at all. And I had- I was mostly running around with stuff like Traveler sets. So nothing's hard. That's why I'm kind of confused where you guys saying the lower the thingy. I'm gonna say that's a very dumb suggestion. <laughs> if 
the world's not hard, why am I going to bother lowering it? Okay, so Oz is on a much higher cooldown than I thought. I'll probably switch back to Child. Yeah. Because cause, uh, Oz is on a much higher cooldown. And that does not work with my flow. That does not work with the flow. From what I've seen, you don't need to. Exactly. I know I'm great. That's why I'm like, who are you suggesting to lower their world? Well, well you better not be talking to me. We better be talking to the person behind me. Shit, insult me. Just because I don't have the op most optimal artifacts in the world doesn't mean I gotta lower my world level. Respectfully? Fuck that. No, disrespectfully, fuck that. Alright, so we're gonna give her back her old stuff. Cause yeah, it's... I'm trying, I'm trying to make Fischl work and it's just not. It is just not. Well, that's okay. All her stuff was max leveled anyway. So it works out. Um. She, what she have here? Mm. I'm trying to remember. What did you have? What did, what did you have? Um. You want your, if you want my Mona, I I would give you my Mona if I could. I can't. I don't want my Mona. I feel like my Mona is a very much- she is very much a waste. She's literally squandering. Alright, so we got that. Now what do we do for this last spot? This last spot's kinda like fuller. You have Child? I do, and he works really well with Kaching. But in my brain, I'm trying to make- I'm trying to make Fischl work. But at the end of the day, Child is much better. And he's leveled, and he's- Thorough, his talents are thoroughly leveled, and his artifacts, I'm going to level them next. Only only way later worlds get you possibly want to reduce. Well, I'm not playing the game to fuck around. I'm just getting through the story, and then I'll take it seriously when I get to endgame. Because at the end of the day, that's what really matters. I'm not going to bother wasting my time optimizing if I'm not even to that point where I'm going to bother. I might want to switch characters. Like, I want to play some of the Sumeru characters. That would be pretty- that will be pretty great! But no. Like, I'm far away from that. Also, what do I want to put in here? Uh... 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 I don't know. Like, this is like a throwaway one. Mm. God, I could barely have anything. Um... Uh, I'll keep this on her, I guess. I'll keep that on her. Do you want this other one to still? Ugh, I can't stand that one. Alright. So let's just fix- let's put Child back in. Alright, for Deha, I'm not ex- I'm, I don't like the new characters. I'm gonna be straight up. I don't like the characters. Something feels mid about them. Both of them. Also, I heard there's an issue with Deha. I think Rose, what was it that you said about Deha again? She might be bugged, but I think it might be the trailer that's bugged, honestly. So I'm not sure. I don't know. I, I look at them and I feel mid vibes. I feel very like they are they are very mid and I'm not feeling it. I am not feeling it, Mr. Krabs. Alright, now this one. Was I trying to go for the full mastery set? Mastery. Yeah, we weren't want mastery for with Kaching. Um do I I don't do charged attacks, so I don't have to worry about this third one, I guess. Eh. Only because there's nothing better, I suppose. What does this shit charge? What does this stuff scale off of? Hydro, hydro, hydro. So far, everything's hydro. Um. I'm so mad at this helmet. This helmet is so kaka. It is so kaka. Like, even my purple's better than that. It's so gross. Um, I guess... Okay, we can switch this out. Mm. Fire 
physical damage. Okay. Yeah, that looks fine. Um, I might want to. Ooh, that plume. That plume kind of hurts my soul. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, they're better pain. Critical damage, attack. Don't want to switch this out. Oh, mental mastery, defense, and attack. Oh. Ugh, no. Um, that's great for him. I might need to switch out. The... No, that that one's fine. I think it has to be the feather. Yeah, we gotta switch out the. We gotta switch out the feather. To told my wallet not to be a bitch. Oh wait, hold on. I'm sorry. Let me read. Let me catch up. I'm so sorry. Thing with child, just make sure you don't stay in melee stance too long. No, because generally I switch out with Kaching very quickly or with Noel, so it don't matter. Um, usually, uh, child's in there just to get some elemental mastery off, and then he switches out for either Kaching to get more uh, electro stuff or get Noel in there to heal if needed. Thing with child, make sure you don't stay. Oh, I read that. I said, I said, fuck the store and went to level my Shinobu. <laughs> Uh, that's what I tried to do, but it made my uh, dailies a little wink wonk. Because now it's kind of, I have to travel all over to places I don't even have, like, the waypoints unlocked yet. I'm ready for Dea. From Want to Beach. Yeah, they seem bad, still pulling for Dea because hot. That's understandable. If you pull her because she's hot, then hell yeah, I respect you for it. Her beliefs don't cause elemental reactions in her main thing is elemental spread. See, Child 1 is the one you need. I like my C, whatever. I like Child as he is. Child doesn't need elemental mastery. Well, the way I'm building him, I do. Hey, how about to wail for Dea? <laughs> Still pulling for Dea because I prefer character over gameplay. That that is that is that is respectable. I respect that. Uh, Meta Meta said bad stuff about my Yomiya, and she's still my fave. What what did people say about your Yomiya? Yep, or took out fifty bucks for her. I'm gonna do maybe that for Shenha if. If my luck is really shit. Meta stuff says bad stuff about everybody, but who knows? Maybe Deha will be for later units. Meta is too is bad for to me. I I I know nothing about the meta, so I'm gonna be dead as honest. I don't know. Not sure if you noticed, but just having child on team buffs. I do, I do know that. Um. I I definitely do know that. Um. Ah. I add a burp. Sorry. Just because I have nothing else better, I'm just gonna keep this and we're gonna modify his stuff later. But right now I feel... I need to get... What do I switch out? Mm, I like that hat. I like that hat. Mmm. Mm. Mm. Well, something's gotta give! Alright. So one of these have to give. For me to get the 18 plus attack. So, and I think it might have to. So this is attack. HP. And attack. Which one gives more attack? Alright, this gives more attack. So we'll take this out and replace it with a... With this damage feather. There we go. Alright. Okay, why am I in fire? I thought I got you! Ooh. Nice. I mean, props? Heck yeah. Meta doesn't like single target DPS. Oh, I oh I didn't know that. I'm killing time. I'm killing time wasting for my. I don't know what a rare a remite. What's a remite? But I solved her AOE problem by pairing her with Raiden. Boom, AOE Oimia and Meta can suck it. I mean, I'm still a very staunch. Oh, I need to give him back his good weapon. I'm a very staunch believer in if you like the characters, that you you, you choose what you like to play and not what's gonna. The only thing that should be you should be worried about metal-wise are artifacts. That's it. 
But even then, we're in a position where that matters. Not at the point I am, it doesn't matter. But if you're in a spot like, you know, like one of the veterans that are like literally like running around restarting new accounts because that's, I don't know. They still want to play Genshin, but you know. Uh, but, you know. Weedle a day? Then yeah, do that. But, um. But just play who you like to play. And make sure it makes sense for your characters or your play style. Because not all the play styles are good for everybody. You didn't go the way I thought you were. You were being such a little... Yeah, play the way you want. And la la la. Ophi, why I'm on fire? Because you're- Oh, I get it. I get it. My characters are technically meta, except for Shinobu. Oh, I see, I see. Alright, so. Let's double check our artifacts. Are they fully leveled up? This one, no. One to level up. Hurt to the max. Alright. So I guess- I guess Child is gonna be here, I guess, because he's like the best fit. And I also do like him too. So I guess it works out. So what's your stuff? Alright, so his book isn't available today. So let's see what else we can level up instead. If not, if there's nothing else available, then hey, then let's farm some artifacts. Let's try our luck. Um, or, or worst case, we'll level up the ones we have already. So, what do you need to be enhanced? Alright, so that's not today. Today is Wednesday. Alright. What do you need? Wednesday? So, not today. What do you need? Not today. <laughs> I'm gonna play more. <laughs> what do you need? Okay, today. All right, we we got we we got a we finally got a today assignment. That's great. Shinobu's a great support. I'm gonna build her one day. Oh, you mean that one hoe that I have that I got mad at because it's another freaking um, it's another freaking uh, electric person that I don't need. <laughs> because apparently electros just love to come home to me and bother me. Because you know it's not like I don't have enough of these bitches running around. That's Dendro. Not that I don't have enough of these bitches running around ruining my day. Because, you know, I can always have more. Except this one. This one's allowed to come. But, yeah. Ching Shu heals? He doesn't technically heal. He does heal, but only through his ult. So, yes. He actually does heal. But just like Diona, it's done through the ult. So, so if you want a healer, then there you go. He's another choice. Um, can I cut this tree? Okay, so where is the thing for his weapon, for the Atmos? Uh, gotta go there. I went to Island for her mats as soon as I could. I, I tried doing that for Sayu, but it was such a mistake at the end of the day. Is there a... Oh. oh, he ran at me. Okay. All right. Why am I not switching? Oh, they're over there. Oh, freaking little climby up thing. Yeah. Let me see where my food situation is at. Because I'm, I'm gonna need buff food. Um, hey, Lucky! Does anyone want to join to help do some high level stuff? If not, I can do stuff that's appropriate of my level. That's fine. Whoa. Alrighty. 
Alright. I mean actually help Jizu. Don't troll me like you did yesterday. I I want I have I got time. I got I need to be on a time frame. I gotta be on a time frame, you see, a time frame. I swear I won't use carpet. Okay, okay. Because you kinda scarred me a little bit. You you had your fun, but I need I need <laughs> Okay. Let me let me turn on requests. That I why do I keep going into the set? It's in co-op. It's in co-op. Alrighty. Hello, Decor! What's up? Elon is nasty with Hydra application? I am very sure. I am very sure. But yeah, what's wrong, Decor? Alrighty. Um, Ali, do you want to join in? And hey, since you're waiting for Fui Fui, uh, um, Sage, do you want to join in for funsies? Ranger, you too? Why not make it a full party? Aw, thank you for gifting, giving the gift to Jisoo. Thank you, thank you, Lucky. How's it going? I can't join you? Why? Did I say a singer? Am I banned? Am I a bad boy? Try, try again. Because I turned on my, my requests. I turn on my request so people can request to join them. If not, that's okay. Let me just check my food. So that way this shit can go faster. Um, let me make more food while I wait for this food. It's great. Try refreshing the page. Um, you should be able to request to join. Uh, where's my food? Let's go into the teapot and start cooking. You're still eating? Okay. Oh, you can't? That's fine. Then we're gonna have to prep to do this alone. Let me turn off my co-op in the meantime, otherwise all I'm gonna hear is And no one wants that. <laughs> well, I don't want that. Alright, first thing we're gonna need is this. Or this. Mm, this one. Okay. Cut this. Let's see. Oh, it's because I have an active. Oh! Well, right now I need to cook food to like make up for my reserves. Because I've been playing a lot offline, uh, getting the stuff I need. So, let me just cook. I also want to get this proficiency up so I don't have to worry about it anymore. Also, I love cooking in this game. It makes my brain happy. It's hard to describe, but there's just like a good itch about it. You know what I mean? Like a very good itch. Alrighty. I don't know why I made that. I'm so confused sometimes with what the best food is and what it isn't. Alright, so we're going to cook this Adeptus food. Let's cook more of this. I'm gonna be so mad at myself if I mess up. This is a cheaper alternative, I guess. Um, healing match HP, max HP increases physical damage. What's this? Oh, that's some cute res food. Uh, I love the omelet rice because the I like the cute dish with Shinobu. Her shit's actually really cute. Uh, hopefully she makes the omelet rice. Damn, it only made one, but look at that. I love this. I love the specialty food from the characters. Like, I love it. It is great. Ayo, Paimon's facing jail time? Hell no. Paimon's not dumb enough to get caught by the cops. Are you kidding me? Paimon ain't that dumb. No, let me see. Oh. Alright. So let's use Diona. Let's pick some decent res food. I need to collect more Sakura petals. Get some more good res food just in case I mess up. Which might be the case. I am dumb sometimes. 
and not the most careful. Ophie is facing jail time. Why am I facing jail time? What did I do? What did I do? Display out! <laughs> Paimon ain't dumb, but people be snitching. Nah. Paimon, Paimon plugs up those leaks quickly. Paimon, what do you think Paimon's running here? You think Paimon's a joke? Is Paimon a joke to you? <laughs> think this is a game? Is this a game to you? Paimon runs a tough ship around here. Paimon don't don't Paimon only holds on to the most loyal. And the leaks get plugged up quickly. No 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 please tell please tell Paimon I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't know. I'm gonna need some 12, uh, no. Five Hail Paimons. I don't know. You're kind of on thin ice right now. I don't know. Paimon don't like snitches. You know what they say about snitches. Best anti-stressing be- Damn. I didn't get double the promise like at all. Whatever. Oh! I need more ham! Do I need more butter? I don't need more butter. Do I more sugar? <gasps> oh, I have meat. Do I need bacon? <gasps> Thank you for your fire, annoying co- I love that. And annoying cosplayer. So, a normal cosplayer? <laughs> No, I have no hate against cosplayers. Cosplayers are funny. A little cringe at times when they're at cons. When you, uh, not all of them, but I, I love cosplayers, but there's certain ones that do inside jokes based on their show. And there's times where it's cool, but then a lot of the other times it comes off cringe. And I like the cringe, but at the same time I cringe. <laughs> Does that make sense? <laughs> like, I love them. They're so sincere in what they do. And I, the way that they have fun, it's infectious. But at the same time, my cringe factor is in the back of my mind. But I do wish they're having fun, and no one can take that away from them. But God damn. It, it, it. God bless them. Kepans are making taiyaki without needing to press this shit. Okay, cool. I promise I'm not that. Cr I don't know. I, I I'm listen. Whenever a cosplayer says they're not, it reminds me of those early 2000s cartoons where they're like, "I'm just not your typical average teenage girl. I'm not like that. I wear Converse with my dress, dress some dress dress." La la la. <laughs> but I am glad that you understand what I'm exactly what I'm talking about, though. <laughs> because I watch cosplay TikTok. Because there's some cosplays, bro. Like, literally out of this world. Like, I stand. God damn, when they go to cons, that's when I when my neck disappears. No, that's when my neck disappears into my chin, and I'm just like, oh. <laughs> you know what I mean? I used to be, but that was 2008, 2019 when I cosplayed my... Why is My Hero Academia... Why is My Hero Academia the one that's always being the problem child when it comes to cosplay? <laughs> or anything in general. Like, bruh, what is it with My Hero Academia, my bruh? What is cosplay? Hello, Darkino Chip! Okay, so cosplay is when people dress up like characters from a, from a series or a video game or a comic or whatever. Generally, anime. God damn it, My Hero Academia. Get off my For You page? No! You get off my Miki! Nah, it's not just MHA, it's also Steven Universe. I feel like that's on the American side, whereas the Japanese side, it is more My Hero. On the American side, Steven Universe is the Japanese version of cringe when it comes to, and the My Hero Academia is on the other side. <laughs> I lied. I knew a cosplay. <laughs> oh. Uh. <laughs> well, it's good to explain for those who might not, because you don't know. We might have some some um, uh, Americans in here that don't know. Uh, my hero fans are weird because my hero fans are thirsty. 
Aren't they like all underage? Why are they thirsty? <laughs> Precious? No, they're not. They're expendable. Besides, I'm still doing what I'm doing, so... Good job for you, I guess. Alright. Uh... Alright, let's go look what we got. Uh, Alright. Poop. I know. Good try, though. You think we're important, Dorkito? It's- ah. someone thinks our time is important and valuable. Ah, good- good for you! Also, let me hire my bitrate, because I think the lag has stopped. Uh, let me just change the bitrate. Now the lagging has settled down. Do I still want help? Oh, are, are you offering the help now? Yeah, I can leave the domain. Yeah, cool. I can leave the domain. I was ready to go in and just eat food and make up for the Fifi and do it level lower. I like you enough to come back even though you're a Gryffindor. I mean, it's not my fault you decide to have good taste for a day. I mean, you can go ahead and not- and have bad taste. <laughs> you can leave and have bad taste. <laughs> Which, by the way, I have a question. On TikTok, I've been seeing all these memes of Slytherin having a rave. Why? <laughs> But tell me, tell me, cosplayer, is it true about My Hero Academia fans and cosplay? I'm assuming based off of reputation, but I want to know if it's fully earned. Oh, well, Oscars are putting in extra security this year. Kawaii. Oh, oh, I'm supposed to turn on my glove. After approval. All right. Yeah, I just turned it on. I, for I, I forgot to turn it off. There we go. Let me know whenever you're able to join Jizu. If you want. If anyone else wants to join, wait'll be. I'm more than happy to have you. Because we'll slip. Oh, that's right. You know what's funny is that I completely forgot about that. <laughs> Truth be told. Like, that was like. Oops. That was like a race from my mind. Oh, pardon me. Alright, so. Can. Alright. Let's go in for fun. Uh, for this one. Keep my watch name out your damn mouth. I think that's what it is. Oh. What happened, Ali? Oh, there we are. Ah, armpits. Good, good, good. That's what we like to see. Also, by the way, y'all crazy because a lot of people, someone clipped when we were talking about Yelan or armpits, having her pits out all the time. Bruh, I just realized, I saw a video on TikTok more about Yelan. Literally, when she ults, she raises her armpits. So y'all be lying when you say you don't notice her armpits. Y'all liars! There's no way you don't notice them pits in the sky. They're there up 24-7. She's, she's like in a, in a Dove commercial. Y'all liars! My opponent is a liar and cannot be trusted. I notice. I'm glad you do, Dorkito, because people act, people saying it's the boobies, which I get it. I understand the boobies. Definitely makes sense, but honestly, like, those pits are bigger than the boobs. Ouch. Animation lock. That was gonna be the kaka. hide behind my shield. Oh, where'd he go? Oh, shit! That surprised me. If I run into these bubbles, I'm gonna- I'm gonna be very triggered. More at myself, because I'm a stupid cucker. God damn it, I ran into that again! Fine. Fine. Switching 
sticking to armpits. If I run into it again, I'm gonna yell at myself very loudly. I should probably eat food just to hire my DPS. And I don't even play this game. Ali armpits the road. <laughs> We are replaying this domain, so don't leave. We're staying unless Yuzu says they want to join the mobile. But stay. You sit your ass down. God damn it! Don't leave! I swear, why do people leave immediately after the first one? Actually, no. Hi, Leon! How you doing? Sit your ass in! You choose the characters you're gonna keep and you stay there. Because we are, we are no lifing, um... Actually. I probably shouldn't do that. <laughs> I should probably pay attention to what I need because I probably shouldn't. I should probably focus on... Um... You know, it's fine. I'm gonna yell at you anyway because I can't. Stop it! <laughs> Stop! <laughs> Bang. Now, uh, who do I want? There's no one else that's really level. I don't have one in there. Eh, I guess what, child? I guess. I'm good now? Okay. You sure? You sure? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Missy too much. How have you been, Leon? You know who I miss? I miss Leo. Come back, Leo. I know you're visiting your mom. I hope you're doing great and wonderful. Bruh, I have like one of those like uh, thermal water bottles that keep your shit cold forever. But I, 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 the problem is, is that I, my bladder is very small. And so the moment I drink water, I'm gonna be getting up and down and up and down. It's gonna be a whole ass thing. So, oh, I, um, I'll charge my phone later. But thank you for the reminder, though. Leia out. Oops. Oh, that's yours. I thought it was theirs. Oh, you fell, so my rock missed. I probably positioned this like the worst way possible, but it is fine. Let me double check something real quick. Let me just make sure. Alrighty, we're gonna we're gonna continue. Don't you dare leave! I swear to God, I lessened my water drinking addiction. So here's the thing that I saw on TikTok that I'm not sure is true, but apparently there are a lot of girls who um, have like three drinks: one for fun, one to keep them awake. I forgot the third one. I, there's a third one, but apparently they're called drink goblins, and I'm like, are drink goblins the people who like um, have like a lot of water bottles at their desk when they're already done? But no, that's not the case. That is definitely not the case. <laughs> is that the uh, drink goblins are women who have three drinks that are being drinken, drunken, drunk at the same time. Color me surprised what for, but there you go. I am! <laughs> I'm eating fui fui! Don't judge me! I feel judged! Don't look at me! Don't look at me! <laughs> I feel judged and attacked! See? Fine. 
fun. Be sure to walk through my thing because it empowers you. Oh, I thought it was ready. It is not. Oh, I ran into that. I want to have it like this. Yeah. Yeah, fighting in their face is a catalyst. Well, they won't be in my face for long just because the way my weapon is, uh, they're going to keep being like knocked back to shit. I walked into it again! I'm so obsessed with walking into these things. I love walking into bubbles. Why not run into them? I love it. It feels like I'm getting hugged. How's it going, gamer? You game in this fine? Heck yeah! So if you simply fall out, no good game? Uh, why? Explain why in your, in your, explain. Explain your logic for that one. <laughs> I want to hear it. Oh, no, you're, you're going to lurk. Never mind. I just realized. Explain why. Where did I say it on Discord? Bring up the proof. Citation, please. Uh, let me see. Also gonna need... There, I'm gonna eat a hash browns. General chat, bring up the quote. Because you can't just talk in generics if you're not gonna bring up a quote. Huh? I didn't say anything about that. Bring up the quote, and I'll, I'll admit what I said. So far, you were getting it wrong. Ooh, that food did freaking worlds of difference. Jesus. Let me. Yes, you better. You but before before you said I said anything. Well, first of all, you're doing the Twitter thing, which is saying someone said something when more than likely I didn't. Uh, but if you bring up citation, I will admit it and call myself a dumbass. I will. I am big enough to admit I'm stupid and I've said a stupid thing I don't mean or misunderstood. But I I did not say anything like that. Oh man, that food alley. Did that food make a world of difference or what? I ate some Adeptus food. Back a weekend ago? Damn. Exactly. 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 Dang, I should probably eat my- Okay, I was gonna say, I was gonna say, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna choke slam. I'm, you know, you fuck around and find out. If you say I said some shit, I'll be like, no, choke slam with, um, you know that Batman meme? Where it's like, da, 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 and it's Batman slapping his knucks rhythmically against Joker's face. It's that. <laughs> So you best come in with receipts. Come in with receipts. Or I'm gonna fight you. Oh, okay. Well, you got me. <laughs> okay. Um, security. That one right there. <laughs> security. Uh, Yiki. That one right there. Can you please? Can you please bring him out the building? <laughs> I can't. <laughs> well, now, now I'm the idiot. I fell for it. <laughs> I did exactly what you wanted. <laughs> Never mind. I am the dumbass after all. <laughs> ah. Listen. Listen. I know when I've been got, and there's times you just gotta. You gotta sit down, 
realize what you've done and, sh you know, just tip your hat. <laughs> oh no, my rocks! Ah, don't hit me! I love standing still and fight. Oh, he disappeared. Never mind. But yeah, how are you doing today, Tokyo? <laughs> like you're doing great. But yeah, damn. I guess eat, eat, use your 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 uppy food if you can. Use your uppy food if you can. When I what do I call uppy food? Anything that boosts your damage. Any little bit helps. <laughs> you did. You did. Though I though um there's two games people ask me. Well, one of them not as much, but the one people ask all the time that is now a meme here is when are you gonna play Fallout? <laughs> The second game is Star Wars, but not as much as the Fallout. Right now, there's too many games in the roster for that to be viable right now. I'm not saying I'll never- I do plan on going back to 4 at some point. Because I do want to do a lot of the side quests and just explore, since we kind of just spearheaded the story. But, um... But, but, but... Um... It, I have too many other games I have in mind, like Hogwarts right now. I have sinned with my own hands. Uh-oh, why? What happened? Did you draw my character with boobies again? So that's the only sin I can think of, but if that's a fun sin. It's not like one of the bad sins. Like, I don't know. Going, waking up early before 12 on a Sunday, I guess, is my only sin I can think of. It's the one only sin I can think of. When are you gonna play Fallout? <laughs> I know. People really love it when I play Fallout. I guess the unique way that I see the world is a good uh is a is a good one for Fallout. God I love C6 Ningguang. She makes my pee pee so hard! Especially with this burst weapon I have, it's really good. My internet fucking died when I said hello. Oh my god, I am so sorry. <laughs> hello, Emperor. I was wondering where you were at. But welcome back. <laughs> Hopefully you're doing great. What missed you? Um, I forgot about shrine keys. They give 40 primo gems each. If you can unlock a shrine, then do it. Defo, do it. When are you gonna- I'm never gonna play Dark Souls. I'm sorry. I cannot do those kind of games. I tried my hand with Elden Ring and that was a nightmare. It's fun, but that, 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 that was a, that was a frickin' trip. When I say trip, I mean I rolled off the thing all the time. Time to draw your character. I would love my character to have be drawn with pancakes. Hope draws character, but not gremlin size. <laughs> oh, I don't want to know about that. I'm gonna pretend like I didn't hear that. Doing great, you're playing like- Emperor! That's the equivalent of saying you shat on the- No! No! League! League, bro! Who hurt you today? Who hurt you today for you to do such a thing? Who hurt you? Says you! <laughs> Am I playing- am I playing Starfield? Starfield Citizen? The game that everyone swore to god was gonna be, um... Whatchamacallit? The one that people accused to be vaporware? That- that Star Citizen? I'm playing- you're playing Halo? I know- uh, are you playing- I'm assuming you're playing with Cody. Oh no, you've been playing it even before Cody. God damn it, Bubbles! That way. 
Overwatch hurt. What, what did Overwatch? Well, to be fair, Overwatch does hurt people. But what did? Where did Overwatch touch you today? <laughs> you know what, Kier? You know what, Kiki? You know what you're about? And I stand. It's weird, but I stand it regardless. Starfield is the new Bethesda game. Isn't Starfield Citizen a game that started out on Kickstarter and then it got bought up by Bethesda? So it's now technically a Bethesda game, but was been working on since before then. Nah, alone. Oh, you play Halo? You never said I... You never said I enjoy that game? Oh yeah, no, he literally just started playing very recently. So it's very new. I threw three games in a row. How did you throw? Did you do those freaking Reinhardt Wars again? That's the only way I can see you through, but even then, like, that's something that's, like, normal. Then again, normal doesn't mean good, but at least it's more, you know, excusable. Um, I like playing Ningguang because it lets me read chat while just pressing buttons! <laughs> I look like a good player when really... She's just C6 and all her talents are pretty much on autopilot for me, which is pretty great! Star Citizen is a game and no- well, it is now, but it- Okay. Star Citizen is a game now, but that game has been development for way too long. Really? He disappeared when I shot my shots? Star Citizen is a different game from different devs. What's the game then that was kickstarted and like, but it kept on getting pushed that back further and further and further? I need to remember what the name of that game is. You should see how much achievements I completed on Halo, on MCC, on your Xbox. Nice. Perfect. Thank you, Ali. I appreciate it. I ran out of resin. Damn, he didn't. Sh he didn't like you shooting your shot, huh? I feel that. Yeah. It happens. Thank you, Ellie. I appreciate it. Uh, now let me see. I'm gonna probably have to go to Leeway. I don't know why. I like going to Leeway because the alchemy table is like right there. Star Citizen? Oh, I'm not playing infinite. Oh, I'm playing infinite, not campaign stuff, just PvP. Oh. And now I'm a mix. I'm, I see uh, how far along we've gotten. I received double. All right, Alheim, give us double the product. Give me, give me giant PC. God damn it! At least you're hot. At least you're hot. All right, is this enough to ascend the Atmos bow? Oh, by leaps and spades. Damn! It is coming along nicely. So now we're just gonna enhance it all the way to 70. Uh, uh, Tartaglia is gonna be so freaking beefy, and he doesn't even have his artifacts leveled up yet. Just gonna use all this stuff. Damn, it's taking longer to upgrade this stuff now, alright. Oh. Heck yeah! Damn, mm, that's what you like to see. Look at that. Sexy. Sexy. I played 3 and stopped at Reach. Oh. I bought my first Overwatch, I'm assuming that says 2 skin. What? Oh, good to know you're playing Overwatch 3. Good, good to know. Um, I enjoyed combat and evolved the first game. Uh, same, I played a lot in high school. Damn, now the numbers are higher. <laughs> That's good, right? <laughs> right? Num higher numbers are genuinely good, especially when it's a legendary weapon. Isn't this, isn't the Atmos bow, who, is the Atmos bow somebody's, um... 
Isn't that, um, Ganyu's signature bow, or no? Is that her signature weapon? Because I, I, I don't know whose it is. All I know is that uh, I saw her with it in the card, so I assume that was her signature weapon. Yeah, PvP, I kind of stopped playing because I enjoyed Halo 3 PvP more in Halo Reach. Mm, I, see, I, see. I recommend going to... Dorkito's a kid, so... You know, he gotta learn somehow. Uh, what was I doing? Oh, yeah! So let's test out uh, this new bow ability. Uh, let's do our... Whatchamacallit. Let me see. Let me see. Alright, so. Escort the balloon. Okay. Oh! Ming Wong needs to eat. Alright, so. Give her this. I think it should be enough. With the, um. It should be enough. With the thingy. Oh god damn it, the freaking payload got in the way. Oh, hello! Oh, I gotta switch around my characters. My characters are in the wrong uh, position. Oh well, let me actually do this real quick. No! My people are not in the correct order! Usually Ningguang is one. I'm, I have to switch people around. I, I am I am shook it. I'm literally shook it right now. Can I switch them around? No. Okay. Usually a uh, child uh, child is four, but he's one. I am saddened. I think so, but I use alloy bow for the Horizon Zero collab. Alright, time to deal with the fact that my- Oh, ouch, Jesus! There's so many of you guys! Go away! Another one? Ah, my numbers are thrown off. Let's rush ahead. Ah. Oh, okay, fine. Ah, wrong numbers. Everything's just thrown off and you're upside down and backwards and you don't know what's happening. It's fine. It's fine. I guess co-op did that to me. Now this one. Stop it! Oh my god, I love it! God, that defense turning into attack makes my PP very hard. Hold on, I'll read the chat in a second. I'm just trying to protect this stupid balloon. Oh, the balloon's fine. Alright. Can I switch around my party now? Because it's so... Alright. You, cheeky little boy, are supposed to go... You're supposed to be here, and you're supposed to be there. There we go. Alright, my, my feng shui has been fixed. 
you're watching Id- Idiocracy? Nice. That's a good movie. Idiocracy, very good movie and funny. I love that movie. Oh, fuck, you just remind me I haven't eaten. Um, eat? Yeah, they made had movies on sale from Xbox Movie Store at 2. Xbox sells movies? <laughs> Six others like Daredevil, Ben Affleck, and Electra Jennifer Gardner. The Electra Jennifer Gardner is not good. That That is, that is not good. Ew, reading chat kind of cringe, right? Right? I would have been fine if it weren't for the fact that um, Child messed me up. And he was in a spot he wasn't supposed to be. He was in Ning Guang's spot. And now, like, my muscle memory is all messed up. And now it's fine. Everyone's fixed. Everyone's fixed, so it's all good. Allie! Um... Alright, so let's test out. Freaking ledges. Let's get down to business! There's more! The fairy. <laughs> okay. Now let's climb up here and see what's up. I'm gonna be honest, so far I do not. I mean, the Atmos bow is really good. It's a really good uh, weapon. Because I think it procs off other people's attacks from what I've noticed. Oh, is this one of those travel things? Oh, it's not. Okay. <laughs> Oh yeah, this is clean. Th this is clean. It's very clean. Now to actually level up his artifacts. Let's level this up. To get my daily login stuff. Oops. Okay. Where is it? Oh, I need to mine ten things. I thought it was four. Okay. Ooh, did I get um? Ooh. Oh, I got another one. What's this? Oh. Hmm. Well, I saw an exclamation mark, but I didn't see anything. So, oh well. What did it say about movies I mentioned? Electra is bad. Oh, the Jennifer Gardner one? That was during the era when the Marvel... I'm sorry, whatever that franchise... Superhero movies were bad back then. But they had, like, a good corniness to it. But I don't know. The Jennifer Gardner one, I remembered um, seeing in theaters. I was not happy. I was not happy. You know, I assume Child is a character, but I will pretend it's not because it's funnier. You're blaming a kid. As per usual, kids are dumb. They're dumb and they don't know better. But no, I'm talking about Tartaglia. I just don't like saying that name because it's such a mouthful. Alright, so next... We have to go all the way over here. Let's see what's up. And then we're gonna do story. <gasps> Lala! God damn it, I didn't turn that shit off! Alright, after this I'll turn it off. I always forget when I invite people, I forget to turn it back off. What's Over. 
Did you heal yourself? I saw that. You healed yourself. Cheater, cheater, pumpkin eater. Why did I ult? I was annoyed that he healed himself. Dare you. Dare you heal yourself. Oh, is this thing healing? Ow! Ow! It's not being healed at all! It's a tree! This tree is just being douchey! Oh, I... I'm, I gotta rush my business out of here. I'm leaving, I'm leaving! God, Jesus. Well, let's heal everyone through this, I suppose. Uh, that tingle? Why? Stop backing up! My blade! Suffocate! There's more! I got terrible. It's kind of annoying that the far away people are hurting me. Like, stop. Respectfully, stop. Stop it. No. I'm not fighting you until I'm done with your twink blood friend! The wrong Alright, everyone got sufficiently healed. Uh, I believe there's stuff for me to mine here. Yes! This is good for teapot stuff. Is there more? Come over here. Oh god, not in this freaking tree. Ah, uh, I want this though. Want that though? Oh, I'm still near the tree. Oh, oh my gosh! So what is that? The wall you kind of put up like a Baptiste alt? Um, yes and no. Um, so how Ning Wong's wall works is that this is a shield, but when you place it, it also does buku amount of damage because this shit hurts. This hurts like a truck. Um, if you pass through it, uh, are uh the characters attack the characters that go through it are empowered. So I try to get my characters to go through here to upgrade their attacks. And it also is a good way to block incoming ta attacks as well when you have bullshit hitting you from far away. Um, so, so it's a she- it doesn't- so it is a Baptiste ult, uh, in a way. Didn't I, like, shoot you? Oops. Well, I guess I didn't. Alright. Oh, why is there, like, a waypoint not closer than that? Um, they might- they might have been bad, but that was the original way of putting it before they changed it in the TV series. Oh, I'm just talking about the movie alone. I don't know anything about the afterwards. Because Elektra is not exactly a character I follow. Like, I, I barely followed, like, any of the characters back then. I was a dumb kid! Um, all I cared for was having a good time, and, um... I did not have a good time on Electra. <laughs> Getting bullied by a tree? I kinda did. Kinda did. Your AR-35? You are really no lifing. You know what? I take back what I said. Blaze is right to, to, to complain about you playing or talking about or playing Genshin 24-7. You got a problem. I mean, then again, I would, I would be the exact same way if it weren't for the fact that I have to stream other games sometimes. <laughs> Don't get lost. Ah, I'll put you on. <laughs> Let's move. Now this Shoot Don't you kills. back away. This guy is annoying. If you don't kill him right away, he is going to like literally be like the bane of your existence. Don't pop if you knock me off this freaking thing. I see through you. You can't run. I miscalculated.
All right, so this guy will just AFK, just walk and spray, so. Literally all this guy does is spray. The one good thing about being Geo is that you can pierce through those shields, but it's gonna take a little bit longer. Jesus. For me personally, those fat ice guys are annoying. They just walk and AFK and walk and flap. Meh. Meh. And lap. Yetas, I fucking told you. <laughs> I hate time. All I did was play through, but nobody listened to me. Also, fuck off, please. Don't fall off. I'm trying. I'm not getting. I'm not falling off. I'm getting yeeted off. <laughs> Don't trust the type. Soon it's a Genshin stream. Damn, Roadhog joining other games because Overwatch ain't paying the bills. True. Like, honestly, that's how I feel. Like, like this guy's killable. It's just that, one, he had a guy protecting him. And two... Ooh. And two, it's like, bruh. What's this? Full poem, you. I do love exploring this game, too. Just get all these melons. And the wood. Do I need another one? Oh. Oh, okay. Well, I guess I- Oh, frick! Oh, I gotta mark this. I don't have a key, but I do, um... But I don't know where this stuff is a lot of the time. I hope it rewards me with those orbs, because I really want to level up uh, the ride gun. Uh, the Rygon, um, statue. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But how you doing, Blaze? I hate the ice spray. The ice spray guy is so, like, literally, he, he doesn't stop and shoot. He just walks and sprays. He looks like one of those, um, those, um, you know those people who, exterminators, who don't care about what you say or do. He's gonna keep doing his job until the job gets done. That's what the ice guy feels like, but, you know, instead of pesticides, it's ice. And then those guys, oh my god, I've seen so many memes of people, like, make- You know that guy that jumps in in front of people and protects them with his shield? Well, there's so many memes I've seen where people like, I hope people care about me the way that, um, that protection guy cares about jumping into other people or some shit like that. And I'm like, oh my god, that's so sad. That's so sad. The magical power flows through me! Where'd she go? Bitch. You ain't safe. Uh, out of oh, I'm stuck! Feet. Oh! There's multiple of them! Alright, well then. Uh, I didn't realize there was two of them. I only saw one. Where are you going? Oh, thank you for the follow, Best Panda! Thank you, ma! 
I will beat up this person in your honor, cause she a hoe! And we only stand hoes that show their armpits here. And she's not showing any armpits! I'm just gonna spindle in this one. <laughs> Why do you keep regen- Bro. Stop teleporting! Bruh. I'm doing fantastic, I cannot lie. I'm vibing, I'm exploring, I'm getting, getting treasures, I'm getting bitches, I'm getting stronger, better, faster. Like, I'm feeling all the- I am in my- I am in my- whatchamacallit. I'm in my era, right? I don't know what era it is, but it's a good one. How about you, Best Panda? Ah! Alright, let's go here. Can I at least go this way? I like how she covers everything up except her shoulders. I know, right? What a whore! I will activate this waypoint and see what that guy is about. Charge my phone? Where is my phone at? Thank you for the reminder! Oh shit! Huh? Yeah, it's at 26%. Oh shit. Maybe she just hasn't been doing her armpit workouts? Well, we gotta shame her so she can get back on it, otherwise she'll never know different. Hmm. What's this? Alrighty, let's go up here. Uh, good, thanks. Who's your mains that you like to- ooh. I don't like that this is so close to a ledge. I guess I have to fight that guy to get this, um, chest unlocked? I presume? I don't mind it, but I think that's what we have to do, because there's no enemies appearing. It's a pretty nice chest, and I need to level up, uh... Actually, can I level up any of his artifacts right now? Wait, does any... Actually, no, I think, um, Ningguang needs a little bit more on one of them. Yeah, she needs a little bit more on this one. It's not... It's not maxed out yet. Alright, what's the side? Why can't I find it? What are you looking for? I'm looking for... For... I forgot. Each time I think I'm about to remember, it, it disappears from my mind. Do you know what I'm supposed to be looking for? Have you looked in your pockets? I already have. It isn't on my purse. Even though I don't remember what I was after, I can tell it was something's not... I can tell when something's not what I'm looking for. Whatever it is, it is not me. Come on, what is it? What am I looking for? Curses, I can't remember. Think about when you got here. All I remember is what I, uh, all I remember doing here is wielding my sword. As for why I was wielding it. Ah, uh -huh, yes, now I remember I was executing someone. If I strike your, if you strike your enemy with your sword, blood surges like a river of red. It gives you a real rush. And when was my sword last stained red? Hmm, it must have been a few days by now. Well, at least you're here today. But now let's leave aside that question of what I was looking for. I've tried myself out thinking. Oh, I've, t I've tired <laughs> myself uh, out thinking about it for so long, and now I need to relax. Uh, it's been a while since I brandished my blade. I can hear Takatsuki Dogger complaining. Ah, uh, listen, she's calling out because she wants to cut you into pieces. <laughs> Having a duel with you would make her very happy. Your sword can't talk. You can't hear Takatsuki Dogger voice. What a pity. Those who live by the sword know to listen to the voice of their blade. <laughs> She's nagging me to get it with it. Come on, draw your weapon! Okay. Draw your weapon and try your chances against me! Oh my gosh! What's happening? It's a samurai movie! <laughs> Unnecessarily widescreen.
screen, okay. All right, on guard. Oh, I might not be. Oh, never mind. I lied. I lied. Cut down. Damn. This. Now what? I am defeated. I have cut countless people down and have never lost once. Now that I have tasted defeat at your hands, I have bet and lost. I shall have no regrets even if it has to cost me my life. You should just stop. Haha, <laughs> I draw my sword to kill. You do not. You fight strangely and your bearings is far from normal. Not all like those who I cut down. Which school do you belong to? I am just a traveler. Heh, <laughs> unwilling to say, are you? It matters little. I remember nothing at all, so even if you had mentioned your school of swordsmanship, I would not have recognized it. Who was I? What did I do before I drifting or before I started drifting here? I am no longer I no longer remember any of these things. I only feel familiarity and peace with my sword in hand. Someone is lost as I must be doomed to wander this wasteland. I can help you. Not but not knowing even my own name. I cannot do anything but wander the world like a ghost. How can you help me? I don't know if I have family or where my hometown is. There is nowhere for me to go but here. The only connection I have to the past is my swordsmanship. Uh, where did you learn? My lineage, I no longer recall it. But it could not have been from out of nowhere. On this path, there is little hope for those who have no background at even if one begins training hard from an early age, they cannot receive accurate instruction if they cannot pay a master to tutor them. They will have to go through many more twists and turns than the average person. Without a good sword, they can only go to the smelting plant to look for a discarded, inferior blade. Though it be inferior, they would cherish it, even give the blade a name. They would train with every ounce of sweat in their body. And after many wounds and much persistence, they would gain a foundation, and yet, they would still be mocked. Without a friend by their side, they would not be able to go on. Wait, why does this all feel so familiar? I think, I think I remember something. Two children wielding swords and sparring next to their family's homes. A hut. Yes, they lived in a hut in a village, a fishing village to the north. The hut was under a cliff and surrounded by sea on all sides. They would take the steps behind the house to the slope to spar. Their blades still might be there. But who are they? Ugh, oh, my head hurts. I can't remember. Didn't you say you would help me? Then please help me find those two sword-wielding children and bring me their swords. I think their swords would be related to me somehow. Okie dokie. A samurai's word is his bond. I will wait here for you until you have brought me those swords. Well, that's a whole ass thing! <laughs> oh my gosh. Nope. I can tell why the solution. Oh, what is it? Well, that was a fun little side quest to start whenever I do it. What server do I play on? I play on America because I'm American and Americans play on American. That's it. Oh, speaking of which, let me turn off the co-op mode. Because I am so tired of hearing a little bullet, bullet. It's not loud, but it makes my eye twitch. The answer is automatically no mooch off someone else's stuff. Disrespectfully yours. Go away. Nameless, I know your true name, Eggplant. <laughs> also, hi, kitty. Hello, hello. Oh! I know... Oh. Wait, 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 where are the relay stones? Oh, I don't know if I feel like doing this one. Uh, I don't know. When I do when it comes to the relay stones, I'm so like meh. Da, da, da. Ah! Well the start of the fight was rad. It was. I mean it's cool to see Noel beat up on this samurai guy, I'm not gonna lie. Now let's see. We're gonna go over here. Ooh. 
Will it block me? Yes, yeah, sneaky. Heck yeah. Alright. Let's go. Ow! I'm going! I'm leaving! Alright, bottoms up. Bottoms up. I'm gonna fight behind this just because there's like people shooting things at me and I know like you know, well let's just say Nikki not a happy camper. Let's see, oop, I hit the bottom. Oh, let me pick up that stuff. La la. Alrighty. Now this one annoys me because this guy falls over. Like, behind the thing when you shoot him. And yeah, it does that. And he's always behind these little things. It's very annoying. I have to usually run up instead of shoot him from far away from the comfort of my own home. Alright, now once you're doing these turn-ins, once we do these turn-ins, we're going to do story. Am I missing one? No. Oh no, no, that's fine. I didn't miss you. Uh, get the chest from below. Oh, oh, sorry. I, I read that way too late. <laughs> Literally, I'm just doing my own thing. Genshin, Ayo, what's up, beast? Welcome, welcome. How are you today? Are you doing great? Amazing. Fabulous, even. I'm doing good. I'm doing pretty good. I got to level up uh, 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 Tartaglia's weapon, which is awesome. Getting my dailies done. I'm, I'm a pretty happy camper, I must say. I'm a very happy camper. And now we're going to continue story as soon as I get these expeditions out. Oh, we're going to need more eggs. We're gonna need, we always need meat for cooking purposes. Uh, some Barbara. Um, for this one. Uh, anything else I need from any... Actually, we could use more of those mushrooms, but if I were to get it, hmm. do you have any character or something? Nah, I like that I have- Shinobu's really good with expedition, so I'd rather... Hmm. I'm just gonna get money. Let's get free money. There we go. Oh, I just had a good dinner, so Ayo! Nice! Nice, I'm logging in to do dailies on Final Fantasy. Oh, you play Final Fantasy XIV, bruh! So do well, not surprising that so do I. <laughs> Oops, I threw down a thing. Alright, so I'm gonna be B. I need to go pee pee. And the moment we go pee pee, we're gonna continue story. Uh last we left off, we were we finished the, the dating episode with Ayaka. So now we're gonna see what happens after the dating episode. So I'm gonna BRB, play some ads, turn off pre-rolls. Um, let me go to my teapot just to get some music playing at the very least. Actually, no, it's quiet. I don't care. Anyway, BRB! So that you don't have to be a good one to art here. Yeah. Cause I, I am, I am like a pre- I, I don't go to school here, but let's act like you do. Let me attempt to draw us. I can make bubbles though. We love bubbles. I love bubbles. I mean, it's hard. To, it's hard to find someone who doesn't like bubbles, really. Attempt. What? No way! What's Did up? you actually do that? You didn't have to do that. Thank you. He 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 gave me three dollars. You had to do that. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Very 
Jeannie. I don't deserve it, but thank you. money from the milkman, baby. Oh my gosh, she... I see why they call you milkman. <laughs> I understand. Also, you're your mom. Ooh. <laughs> it's been a while. <laughs> ah, lies. He probably is like a secret esports player that's been like, I don't know. Yeah. There you go. Ooh. Stop it. Stop it. <laughs> Stop it. Cut Stop the, the video. Cut the feed. <laughs> I'm sorry. You got five dollars, don't you? I, I don't know. I don't know. No, no, that, that's just me mocking it up. You got five dollars, don't you? Something like that. Right. Okay. I am back. Alright, so. Let's get our achievements in. Before we continue. Let's also get- collect all of our fate- or what is it called? Um... Oh my god. These, because we are stockpiling them. How many do we have right now? We're gonna stockpile all the Primo gems that we get just for Shinha. Five dollars! I know. That's so cringe. I, mean, I understand you're getting your bag, but there's like a line. There's a frickin' line. Alright, so... Let's see... Can I do this one? Alright, we gotta go there for a reason, I don't know. It's a story time! Five dot- no. Heck no, I don't want it. I don't want that. I don't want that. No, thank you. I know it's a meme, but cringe. Cringe. <gasps> oh, I want those! Yeah, Sakura petals. All right. It sucks I can't kill these foxes. All right, I don't know why we're going here, but we're going here. Huh? We're looking for the great Munjina Yokai. Do you know where it lives? Great Munjina Yokai. What's that? Ah, you never heard of it? It's a sneaky monster that goes around playing tricks on people. It's got magic powers that can even shapeshift into anything it wants. One time, the great Gina Yokai stole some rice from our house, and this time it pushed my dad into the river. Sounds like a very naughty little monster. And why do you want to get it? Because we finally found out how to chase it away. My dad said the gray Moonjin no Yokai likes to play tricks on people who stay out all the time and don't come home when they're supposed to. So, we, oh, all we need to do is chase it away and then we can come out and play whenever we want. This monster sounds scary though, aren't you guys afraid? Surely your parents must be worried 
worried about you. Not really. I told my dad I was going to find the Great Moon Gina Yokai with some friends, and he didn't even say anything. So, we think it must be weak right now. It's probably hiding away so it can rest. Yeah, so as long as we get home before it gets st strength back, we'll be safe. Hmm, sounds something's very strange about all this, but Paimon can't say exactly what it is. Um... The dad's attitude don't sound right. Yeah, Paimon feels like Great Moon Jaina Yokai is one of those storybook monsters that doesn't exist in the real world. I think so too. We should tell them so they don't waste their time looking for it. All children, listen up! There's no need to go looking for the Great Moon Jaina Yokai, alright? Because it isn't real! Huh? No way! That's impossible! My dad wouldn't lie to me! Your folks are just worried about you is all. They don't want you wandering too far from home because it's too dangerous. That's not true. The great Moonjaina... I call him Moon... Why keep on wanting to call him the Moonjaina? <laughs> the great Moonjaina yokai is definitely real. Yeah, Yo Yoimiya is even making some weapons for us. And then she's going to show us how to blow it up. No Yoimiya, huh? Wait, as in fireworks prison break Yoimiya? We told her about all the great Munjina yokai. She said we shouldn't be scared of it. We should learn how to chase it away instead. We've been waiting for ages now, and finally Yoimiya said that today's the day. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Yoimiya plays with us and tells us stories all the time. She wouldn't tell a lie. What? What? Hmm. Can't look. Come on, let's get out of here and find Yoimiya. Wait, hold on, don't go! Uh, they didn't seem to take that very well, but Paimon was only trying to look out for them. Who knows what Yoimiya's got to do with this? Let's follow the kids and see what's going on. Moonjina? Uh, don't make fun of me why I call it Moonjina, okay? I just, I can't help but feel compelled. Whoa, Paimon's voice actor is real? <laughs> nah, I just like, I like imitating Paimon. Paimon's a G. That way, when Paimon calls someone the N-word, it's good! <laughs> I would never say the N-word. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. That's so bad. Alright. We gotta catch up to the children. I know it's not exact. I could probably do better, but nah. Finish that sentence. Who's in Paris? <laughs> Cheer up, guys. Don't be so down. He was only joking back there. How would the great moon Jin no yokai not exist, huh? But we never seen it for ourselves. That's because the great moon Jin no yokai is extra powerful. And that's exactly why I need your, your help, isn't it? Um, it's okay. Don't be discouraged. Hey, remember, if you want to be a hero, you ha you got to have patience and wisdom, too. Even if you can't find it right now, it'll definitely show up before the fireworks show starts. So remember to come and pick up your weapons from me before then, okay? No matter how powerful the Great Mungina Yokai can be, it's no match for my specially made fireworks. Just light them up and you'll scare it off. Nope. You're trying to make a sale! Don't even. It's up to you guys to protect your homes, your crops, and your folks. Got it. Thanks, Miss Yoimiya. Stop putting these ideas in these kids' heads. Oh yeah, hold up a sec. I have a few slips of paper for you guys. One each. Remember to give it to your parents and tell them to keep it safe. Just tell them it's from Yoimiya. They'll know what, it, what it's about. Okay, thank you, Yoimiya. We're going back now. Thanks, Yoimiya. Come play with us soon. I'm going to rip her a new asshole for lying to children. Sure do. We'll take care on the way back. See you later. Ah, uh, so... It's been a while. Ah, so it was you- it was you guys! I guess it's much from the way the kids described you. No worries, I'm not blaming you. No, I'm blaming you! The Great Mungina Yokai is pretty popular with the kids, so of course they're gonna get upset if someone tries to tell them it doesn't exist. Okay, but it definitely doesn't exist, right? Yeah, the first time I heard about it, I knew straight away it was probably something the parents had come up with to stop kids from running off all the time. But when the kids asked me about it, I didn't want to break it to them. I just told them that it looks cute, like likes to play pranks and doesn't hurt people. So I guess now the kids' impression of the great Munjina yokai is mostly influenced by me. Huh. So in a way, this monster-
monster is all a product of your creativity. Surely it's a bad idea. It's a lie. It's bad. Maybe so. In any case, I'm not going to be the one to expose it. But you're going to be the one to fucking cover it up when I try to tell- I tried to be that person and you covered it up. So, bruh. I don't like this. I don't like this. I don't mind lying about Santa Claus, but this is a Santa Claus. This is literally like what the old boomers would say. They would tell you that you're no- like, what is it? To keep kids from running off, they say that you get kidnapped, which it is, it is true, but they would, like, hammer that point home, and I don't like it. Surely it's like- it's likely that the parents just wanted to stop the kids from staying out all the time. Then just tell them not to go out. Simple as. There'll be consequences if there's not, instead of lying. But they have- they could have easily had other reasons, too. If I go ahead and tell them that the Great Mungina doesn't exist without knowing the full story, then who knows? I may be doing more harm than good. No, you're doing good because you're making parents be parents. Besides, they're just kids. They should be allowed to believe it uh, if it makes them happy. Uh, that's more important to them than questioning what's real and what isn't. I don't agree with your beliefs at all and you're stupid. Heck, I entertain my fair share of fantasies too. But the fire diamond that spins around and shoots out lights that are all the colors of the rainbow? Oh, the mist spirits that live far off in the mountains and guide you to fairyland if you can find them? I know that fairy don't really exist, but I still enjoy believing in them. If someone came up to me and started telling me to stop being so stupid they don't exist, nya nya nya, I'd give them the evil eyes and tell them to get the heck out of my face, because grr, that's so annoying. Why be so childish about it? Yeah, I'm literally gonna fight you on this, why? Yes, let's poison our youth. We're not poisoning the youth, we're being real to prepare them for the real world, because otherwise they're gonna get people who are delusional. And we don't need any more of those. You and Mia needs to be arrested, please. Ovi about to throw hands. I will. Because maybe it doesn't matter so much if something's real or not. Maybe magic and awesomeness are what makes something worth believing. Why should something else get to... Someone else get to take that away from you? Because they're actually afraid of it. There's nothing fun about it. The things we believed and the experiences we had when we were young turn into priceless treasures as we grow up. No. When you were kids, surely you guys believed in things like heroes who slayed dragons and sacred swords that cut through darkness. Those actually exist in this world, so those are bad examples. They're literally dragon, there are literal god people that came down and shaped the earth. There's literal gods among us. So, and there are sacred swords. So literally not the same thing. If we were to tear apart these kids' fairy tales now, what else do we have to tell them? Uh, cool stories about real people to inspire them to do real things. That Inazuma is locked down? All the grim tales of the Vision Hunt Decree? I think it's a bit too early for that. Tell them about the freaking gods. Tell them about how cool Raiden is. Tell them about how cool their Shogun is. It's, like, it's so easy. Huh. Oh yeah, for sure. Don't you agree with this, Paimon? Just because she gets all fruity about it doesn't mean it makes her any less or any more right. No need to pretend if you didn't understand. Oh, you didn't follow that at all, did she? <laughs> yeah, don't pretend if you don't know, Paimon. <laughs> Whether you understood me or not, don't you worry. I'll take care of the kids and make sure they stay safe. Well, that's what matters at the end of the day. I don't... Don't protect them and don't lie. That's it. Ah, oh. The only thing that people are allowed to believe in is Santa, because Santa- Krimla- Krimla's different. Krimla is the only thing that it's allowed to- to- to be fifi. Krimla is sacred. Ah, okay, it's about time I headed back. The- Oh god, these fucking Japanese names. Naga no Hara fireworks show is just about to, around the corner, and there's still a lot of things to get ready. Naga no Hara fireworks show? Um. Is that hosted by your family or something? Well, yeah, I mean, that's why our name is on the event. It's well known throughout Inuzuma. Oh, and on the subject, are you busy these days? If not, you should totally come along. I'll prepare an extra pretty fireworks show just for you. Sure, why not? I like fireworks. <laughs> In that case, come with me to Naga Nohara. We'll, we'll go see my pops. We'll go see my pops? Okay, there's still a few fireworks to finish off before the show. Alright. Yeah, tell us about how El Presidente is. 
I mean, hey, there's people who roast- who, Listen, y'all want her to still step on you guys, so I don't even want to hear it. <laughs> Especially from you, Allie, number one riding simp. Like the story about Benjamin Rush, a founding father who founded the first actual school for women, created a more humane prison, and was an ab abolitionist. There you go! Real people doing real things, not pretend fake. Give people real dreams and don't give them delusions. I'm all good for delusions that make people happy, not the ones that make people scared to do things. Like Santa Claus? Awesome. Easter Bunny? Great. Stuff that makes you happy? Awesome. But, but the, but the mean stuff? No. Well, it's not mean, but just no. I don't like it. It don't sit good with me. Hey, Pops, I'm back! The fireworks show is almost upon us, and the fireworks for each family are almost ready. Oh, new faces? Who are these two? Friends or customers? A bit of both, actually. They've arrived in Inazuma just recently. Can't we let them? Oh, uh, can't let them miss out on a fireworks show after coming all this way, can we? <laughs> ha ha ha! Well, either way, come in and have a seat. And I, Naga Nohara. Oh God, these Japanese. Ryo no Suke will tell you all about the long history of the Naga Noharas. I can wait, pops. I need to ask you about something. If you tell us the history, can you do it in song? A long, long time ago. Some things burn, and uh. other things don't. Huh? Rocks, they don't burn. But somewhere along the line, a rock was set alight, and it burned the most beautiful color. People took one look and thought, hmm. Pops is telling us stories rock, again. Or was it something else? Because the rock Sorry about this. Ever since Pops had his up. accident, his ears Back don't work then, well. Of course. People didn't know that really? it wasn't just But for a moment, rock. it also seemed it like you were having a, cohe oh, a coherent conversation. Much later, people eventually realized that if you grind certain minerals into dust, they burn any beautiful colors. Pops, Pops, wait! Uh, what is it? Did they deliver those firework materials that we ordered yet? Oh, yesterday's fireworks have all been delivered, so have the ones from the day before yesterday and the ones from the day before that. No, Pops, I meant the materials. The materials that we ordered, they should have arrived today. Today's fireworks are almost ready, too. Don't you worry. <laughs> your two old... Your old man skills are still as sharp as ever. No, Pops, the materials. The raw materials for making fireworks. Sorry? What? The materials! Oh, the materials? Yes, yes, the materials! Sorry, 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 Paimon got all excited because y'all finally got the message of Christ. The materials aren't even- oh, I- Well, he's being a pop, so we're gonna have to talk in old voice. <clears throat> well, the old materials aren't here yet. The couriers did come over to explain why, but, well, I think they did. Uh, but I couldn't quite hear what they were saying. No worries, as long as we know, that's fine. We can just make them later. Oh, uh, don't forget to take the goods in when they deliver them, okay, Pops? Of course, leave it to me! So sorry if we were a little loud. But oh, it's always that way, though. It's like that every time. I need to ask Pops something. I think you two are similar. <laughs> I get told that a lot. Because my Pops is deaf, he never argues with anyone and never contradicts them. He just listens cheerfully. When I was little, I thought it was because he really understood me and agreed with whatever I had to say. So I'd tell my pops everything. Eventually, I realized the reason he was like that is, is that he was deaf. But I still tell him stories every day. Huh. Why would you do that? It just makes me happy to see him smile. And it, for it keeps him from being lonely, right? Anyway, more importantly right now, the fireworks show is right around the corner. And the materials still haven't arrived. We need to think of an alternative. Yo, yo, Mia, is that you? Who is that? <gasps> Why, you scared me! I thought I told you to be more careful when, uh, before you speak. Sorry. Hold on, I'm coming over. Who is, who, who, who is this? No one's looking. Okay, you can come out now. Come out around the side. Hmm? Ooh, 
are you her secret boyfriend or something? Oh, we're lucky that no one from the Tenryo Commission was around, otherwise we'd all be in big trouble. Sorry, I guess I was a little rash. When I heard you j came back, I just... Don't worry, uh, Sakujiro. So far, at least, every everything is good according to plan. Or everything's going according- I know how to read! We're going to look for firework materials shortly. We're all out. We're sort of... We'll sort out the boat situation for you, as promised. Is that the guy we broke out of jail? Thank you for all your help. Why was he hiding in your house? He's one of our old customers. He came back to Inazuma from the outside world not long ago. While he was smuggling himself in, the Tenryo Commission found him and put a warrant out for his arrest. An arrest warrant? Paimon's also got one of, well, many of those! Shh, keep it down! We don't want to draw any unwanted attention. If Sakujiro's caught, there's no knowing what crimes they could charge him with. All we could do is find him a boat and I can send him out of Inazuma again. But isn't there, like, a thunderstorm? Yeah, we know it's going to be dangerous, but there aren't many options left. What if the boat capsizes? Ugh, drowning's really scary! If, if things are this bad, couldn't you have just not come back in the first place? Oops, I clicked off. Well, there is something I felt I had to do. But as soon as I got back, I started hearing about all these unbelievable changes I had made. Oh, I had made my mind up originally, but now I'm not sure anymore. I didn't want to cause any trouble for Yoimiya or Mr. Ryunosuke, but I'm very grateful to them for taking me in. Hey, no worries, you're more than welcome. Remember what I said? As long as you've got that little piece of paper, you'll always be valued, uh, uh you'll always be a valued customer of the Nago no Harps. Little piece of paper? Like the slips you gave to the kids? Yep, the same paper slips as the ones I gave to the kids earlier. Whenever a customer orders fireworks for a commemorative event, we always include a little paper slip with the goods. Only people from inside my family can understand what's written on it, and it's the recipe for the fireworks they ordered. If someone shows a Naganohara that paper slip, we guarantee that we can make the exact same firework as the original one they purchased, whether it's 10 or even 100 years later. <gasps> wow, that's so awesome! It's a family tradition. All our regular customers know about this. The slip I have is from back when my parents ordered fireworks from Mr. Ryunosuke. Uh, now that I think about it, it must be nearly 20 years ago. Uh, what I would have thought that things have turned out this way. The way they have. It'll be fine. Escaping in a boat is just a, a last resort for it if there's no other way. I'll still try to come up with a different solution because it's much better if you could stay in Inazuma. Whatever their reasons might be, if our customers come to look at us looking for help, we're not going to leave them high and dry. Thank you. This way I'll still have some time to consider my options. Alright, well, let's not stay out here in the open for too long. Hurry up and get back inside. I'll let you know as soon as I have an update for you. Thank you. I'll leave you to it then, I guess. Alright, cool. I'm going to call this guy Nick Ryan. <laughs> No, I'm her server. I'm I'm her. Cr I thought you were Raiden's boyfriend. Ah, oh, what a shame. They still wouldn't give him a permit, even though he was born and raised inside Inazuma. Speaking of, you guys only got here recently. How did you manage to get a permit? We got it through a long bureaucratic process on Rito. Even though we only got through thanks to the help of Miss Higari Chisato of the Kanjiro Commission. I see. So you had Big Shots helping me. I guess that won't be much help to Saki Jiro. Ah, I wish some commissions could be a little more flexible. I bet nowhere else you could have been you've been is quite like Inazuma, huh? Each Archon has their own idea on how to run things. Ah Well no matter what I have well, no matter what, I have to find a way to help them. I'm sorry I invited you to come and watch the fireworks, but now I have to run a few errands. You don't have to join me if you don't want to. I can sort out the firework materials by and the boat by myself. And then you can come and meet me back later. Uh, I don't mind. I'll tag along. Oh, cool. Then let's start with the Sakijiro's boat. Uh, you can chat. You can chat along the way. 
I'm Yomiya's boyfriend. I'm Raiden's bitch! Bruh. Can I finally do, like, the main quest now? Okay, I can't do that. Hold on, I'm confused. So what quest am I supposed to do? Uh... Okay. It's telling me to start axe, and I'm like, I don't know what, what these axe. Uh... Uh, oh, so I have to do this. Okay. I was wondering if this is a side quest, which it technically is, but it's forcing me to do it, so. Whatever. I'm down. I'm down. Woo! I mean, if, as long as I get Sakura petals at the end of the day, I vibe. Alrighty. Done with work meeting, another one in 30 minutes. Don't be a corpse slave. You know what's funny is that I think I saw a um, a TikTok video news clip where the Taliban, uh, when they started running things, they said that they hate the one thing they can't do is corporate jobs. So apparently, corporate like life is the one thing that can probably destroy the Taliban. <laughs> apparently, that's worse than be than you know the other shit they were doing. Kalichi, I'm here. How is the boat coming along? Yeah, it is all right, I guess. Um, I qu I was questioned though. Wait, wait. Should we really be talking about this in front of them? Oh, don't worry. They're my friends. You can trust them. They came with me to check up on the boat. Yeah, you could say we're all in the same boat. <laughs> Pleasure to meet you. Oh, I see. Sorry, I didn't mean to doubt you. I'm just being cautious. The boat is ready, but I'll have to be discreet moving it here. Huh? Why is that? Because of the Sokoku Sokoku decree. The Tenryo Commission is really suspicious of any kind of seaborne vessel. And even the smallest ones. They'll stop and interrogate us, demanding to know what we plan on doing with it. It's a real nuisance. I understand. I'm sorry for dragging you into this mess. <laughs> Don't be silly. I'm actually happy that you came to me for help. I've always come to you for fireworks, and again this time. So just consider this my way of saying thank you. Right, I'll go fetch the boat now. I should be back shortly. Thank you. If it's on the way, you can also you can always pick up your fireworks from my house. Everything was made in strict accordance with uh, what was on the paper slip. You won't find the slightest thing wrong with them. All right, then the fireworks show will be starting soon. Odin. Well, you should make your way. You, you should make sure your new friends get to see it. It's an Inazuman tradition, after all. Yep, that's the plan. Oh, you know what? You should tell them about your past, about the first time you ordered fireworks from my family. That's a long story, actually. Where do I start? Uh, oh, maybe I'll come back to that after moving the boat here. Oh, right, yeah. Got caught up in the conversation there is all. Okay, well, I'll leave you to it for now and meet you back here later. <laughs> Lucky he reminded me. Otherwise, I would have ended up chatting the rest of the day away. I've been so busy with the fireworks business these past few days that I haven't been having a moment to stop and chat with anyone. It's killing me. Of course, Pops is happy to listen to me chatter away. But because he can hardly hear anything, it's difficult to get anything interesting from him. And I'm doomed again, aren't I? Uh, what I meant what I meant to say was, while Koichi is bringing the boat here, we shall try to find some firework materials. I need to make fireworks not just for you guys, but for those kids and Sakijiro as well. We're missing a lot of the materials. If it's too much trouble, don't worry about us. It'll be fine. It's actually like this every year. There's always a bunch of extra orders to slot in here and there. When people want fireworks, it's always because they have something to commemorate. And if they miss the chance, they might never get another one. So, no matter how busy I am, I am always happy to take their orders. So what you're saying is that, is that you enjoy your work? Oh, I do, really. Uh, being born into a family of fireworks makers, I feel like since I was a kid, I've been obsessed with watching fireworks, or watching things go boom, and then seeing all the lights and colors. Ugh. 
What, what I really wanted to say was, don't worry about me, it'll all be fine. Your main point got buried in extra information. Sorry, sorry, it's just that good conversation can be as fleeting as fireworks. Sometimes, you know? Uh, so when I'm in the mood and I've got a lot to say, I just have to get it out there in one go and leave no regrets. Let's head to the city. I think I'll try my luck with some people that I know. Alright, so I guess, is this another shopping episode? But instead of, uh, of Ayaka, it's Iomiya? Oh no, I have 2,250 Mora to my name. Damn. Imagine being poor, it couldn't be me. Time to start working on those ley lines. I hope you have resin. And once you let corporate drain you until nothing matters, but the grind, it's not so bad. <laughs> once you're a lifeless husk, it's fine. What happened with the voice's audio? Let's see. Oh! <gasps> I never turned it on! Paimon uh, coming in! Paimon coming in! I was wondering what was wrong. I was like, isn't this like main story? <gasps> I turned it off because I forgot to turn it back on. That's funny. Whoops. So is this voice acted? Hello, Morihiko. How's Oops. business these days? <laughs> Oops. <laughs> <laughs> Yoy Mia, there you are. Okay. I thought you might show up. Ha, ah, no need to beat around the bush. You're here for the fireworks materials, I assume. I put a batch aside just for you. I only no do it when I have to. Enough. Not because I want to. Huh? Really? How did you know? Because a fireworks show is coming up. And that usually means you'll be running all over the place trying to get your hands on some last minute materials. I've come to expect it now. <laughs> There's always a few extras unaccounted for, eh? The AFK. I'm so sorry uh, for oh. bothering you every time. Ah, oh, come on now. You know I didn't mean it like that. I'd sooner have my business go under than turn down one of your requests. Here's the thing. I would not turn it off if it weren't for the fact that the characters talk too much when, when we're AFK. Like, literally, they cannot shut up. I love my characters. But dead ass, if I hear Kaching telling me about my work life balance being off and this is ridiculous, I'm going to literally like I, I cannot stay like they that they talk too much. It's not my fault, okay. What about you two? Are when I you need it, it I forget to turn back on. Made? Yeah, thank you. Yeah, thank you ever so much. <laughs> it's no trouble at all, my friend. Ah. <sighs> Once when I had an argument with my son, Yoimiya was the one who came and calmed him down. I'm hopeless at communicating with him. If it wasn't for Yoimiya, who knows, he probably would have run away by now. Nah, he was never gonna come to that. He's a sensitive kid and he cares a lot about your feelings. It's just, he doesn't know how to express it. Maybe if you turn that frown upside down once in a while, he might feel more at ease. Yeah, I guess I'm probably too serious around him. Which is strange, because I don't think I'm anything like that when I'm talking with other people. Don't worry about it. No one's perfect. If you have any more trouble in the future, just come to me. Even if it's not fireworks related, I'll happily oblige. What's Guys Paimon's face for? First. Always. <laughs> All right, then. Everyone's always saying what a good kid you are. Your father must be very proud of you. Go ahead and take the ore, by the way. It's on the house. Ah! No, you don't! That's out of the question! Don't worry. Just take it as a token of my gratitude. Gratitude won't pay your bills, though. Don't do this to me. Can't we just play by normal business rules here? I already said it's fine. Please, just take it. Surely you've got a load of other things you need to get done today. Um... How about this, then? I'll record this in my notebook, and we can consider it a down payment against any fireworks you want to purchase in the future. <sighs> There's no convincing you, is there? All right, then. If you insist. Pass on my regards to your dad. Tell him Morihiko wishes him health and happiness. Will do. You look after yourself as well. Don't push yourself too hard. You don't want to make yourself ill again. 
Everyone seems to really like you, Yuenia. Seems like you'd, you'd, you'd happily do anything for anyone. You're not the first person to say that. In fact, some people think I'll literally do any favor they ask me to. Pretty much. When that happens, I say to them, Hey, this is a fireworks store. We do fireworks. But... Fair enough. Uh, they don't always listen, so it can't be helped. But also, it's not really a big deal. Anyway, we've got all the materials we need now, so that solves that problem. Next, we just need to go find someone to process them. Okay, cool. Yeah, Hu Tao does the same thing with her he with her hilly curls, which is why I idle with Yelan since she talks if she talks if her dice rolls a six. <laughs> uh, guess we go here. Ah. Mr. Aminoma, it's me! Ah, Yoimiya. If I'm not mistaken, you must be here for some firework materials. Seems like everyone knows how busy Yoimiya gets leading up to the fireworks show. I'm very sorry. Would you be able to wait for a while? I have quite a backlog of weapons orders right now. No worry. Oh, oh wait. Actually, uh, yeah, that could be a problem. Uh, some worries. How about this? Do you need a hand? As long as we can get through your orders, you can help me process my ore, right? I have uh, a thing in my teapot I can help you with. We don't need this guy. Master. Oh, you don't mind, do you, Mr. Aminoma? As you know, it's not long now until the Naginohara fireworks show starts. There's still a lot of fireworks left to make if I don't finish them on time. Talkative as ever, I see, dear child. The essence of Amenoma art is patience and focus. When the mind is disturbed, it will show in the blade that is forged. If you badger Hajime like this, you will only succeed in disrupting his concentration. But, but this is a special circumstance, surely! The Naganohara fireworks show is right around the corner! I like that he keeps so talking as he hammers. And I will process it for you. Huh? Master, you mean you'll do the work personally? Is that so surprising? It is, after all, the only option. Thank you for helping out, Mr. Aminoma. You're quite welcome. The Naganohara fireworks show is an important event. This, I know well. In addition to this, I am indebted to Ryunosuke for all the business he has given me. But Yoimiya, you should plan things more carefully in the future. Do not rush everything at the last minute. <laughs> I'll try my best. In the future, I'll get some extra materials in to cover any unexpected changes of plan late in the day. <sighs> Though for you, dear child, no matter how much you prepare in advance, it may never be enough. Excuse me, I will be back shortly. I like her. I like her when she's wow, not lying children. Mr. Aminoma, just look at the shape and size of these grains. It's beautiful. I'm at a loss for words. It's I love her nails. Since I've seen nails you take cute. up your tools, but it looks like my pipe swing wing. Oh my god. Oh man, looks like he'll throw out his back by watching. I have watching. studied these <laughs> techniques my whole life. They are impossible for me to forget. So have a Minima Art and Naganohara fireworks been working together for a long time already? Back in the day, it was my master and Ryunosuke's father. The people may have changed from one generation to another, but the ingredients required to make fireworks have remained the same. Hajime, in the future, this will be up to you. I know, I know. No pressure or anything. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I won't bother you guys any longer. Oh, remember to come and watch the fireworks. Okay, time to head off. Koichi probably isn't back just yet, but let's go wait for him. Got this swing. <laughs> ah! <laughs> there we go. Just as 
I thought. He isn't back yet. But not to worry, because actually, I've been hoping for a chance to have a nice long chat with you all day. What? I'm sorry for dragging you with me everywhere. Everyone's been so good to me, though. It's all gone really smoothly. <laughs> <sighs> Feels like Paimon has barely spoken a word this whole trip. Sometimes, Paimon, when the bitches take you out, as a man, we're gonna have to just endure whatever they throw at us, so that way they don't kick us in the ass for not paying attention and spending enough time with them. As a man, you just gotta carry their purse, nod, tell them that that girl is at work is definitely wrong and you're right, and life will just work out. Also, it's just nice listening quietly, I guess. I felt like I was neglecting you guys, so I wanted to find an opportunity to catch up. When we first met, I was in a hurry. We didn't have a chance to sit down and have a proper chat. You guys are travelers, right? So, where else did you go before coming to Inazuma? Liyue. I haven't been to Liyue before, but from what I've heard from Miss Beto, it sounds like a really interesting place. But something big happened there recently, right? Didn't their Archon leave all of a sudden? Yeah, a lot of crazy things went down as a result. Luckily, everyone worked together to stave off a huge disaster that could have wiped out the whole city! Oh, well, that's good to hear. I gotta say, it's pretty remarkable that the citizens managed to step up and keep things going even after their Archon left. I mean, I sure can't imagine Inazuma without the Shogun. My friend once said to me that only people with a strong will and a clear purpose decide to go traveling. Maybe it's to see a certain view or to fulfill a certain wish. So, what made you guys embark on your treacherous journey to Inazuma? I'm looking for my sea star. And we're looking for answers from the gods, too! You were separated from your family because of a god? Oh... That must be really tough. I'm slowly learning to cope. <laughs> I like that I'm slowly learning to cope. Paimon, don't hate Paimon because Paimon is beautiful. Maybe if you got rid of that yee yes -ye haircut, you have some primo gems in your profile. Damn. Damn, the call okay. out. <laughs> well, if that's how it is, then that's how it is. <sighs> you know, I was going to ask if you guys wanted to stay here in Inazuma. Fuck no. Unlike the outside world, what Inazuma seeks is eternity. In other words, a state of tranquility where very little ever changes. That's the bad. advantage of that is that if you're ever tired from your journey, Inazuma's a great place to come and rest. Um, uh, let me put it this way. I was just worried that you might be getting weary. If you keep pressing on in that state, you might start to lose sight of the things that made you want to start your journey in the first place. I have a teapot for that. <sighs> Sometimes. That's also just how it is. When you're True. exhausted, everything becomes an uphill struggle. Even trying to have fun. You won't be able to enjoy yourself if you're too tired. I got a teapot for that. An adventure friend of mine once told me that if you're too focused on reaching the end of the race, you'll miss a lot of opportunities and precious moments to be had along the way. I'll bear that in mind as I rush to Inazuma and ignore everything along the way, besides the man's story. Don't worry, though. I'm sure I can think of some way to get you feeling relaxed and happy. And you're here now, so even if you're gonna leave eventually, I want to make sure you at least leave with fond memories. Aw, that's Who actually knows? nice. Once you're reunited with your family, maybe you'll find Inazuma the right kind of place to call home. <laughs> oh, oh no. Oh no, 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 no. Oh, you you are you are you are so adorable. You you sweet summer child, you you keep on lighting your fireworks. You don't. I don't. I. This is the last place I ever want to call home, ever, ever, ever. If I want to feel oppressed, I'll go to Cuba. I'm sorry. We are in Cuba, but in Japanese weeb Cuba. <laughs> Traveler, huh? No, I'm getting the fuck out of here. Exactly. Traveler, she's inviting you to say yes. No. All the yes. No. It depends on what my sister think. I'll add it to the list. <laughs> I there already have an idea of the color and type of fireworks I want to give you guys. I'll keep it a secret for now, though. Yoimiya, I'm back. Uh, sorry to keep you waiting. Uh, let's head over to the boat. I oh, I'm gonna find uh, my ass plopping in leeway Chang faster than I ever longer? think about. I'm gonna I'm gonna plop my ass in leeway, or depending how nice Fontaine looks, 
Fontaine. No. Sumer? I don't know. Those are my three. But Inazuma's not on that fucking list at all. I'd rather just say Monset. Monset is really beautiful. That is a good choice. If it wasn't so barren and so plain, I would choose Mondstadt because I do like the style of if, uh, the the German style fits my princess fantasy idealations. But maybe I think that the French place will probably be okay, better. Okay, good. Never that really. Let's go then. Just act naturally, though. We don't want to raise any suspicion. If it can withstand the storms out on the ocean, it must be super sturdy, right? Absolutely. Rest assured that the quality is guaranteed. I'm looking forward to Fontaine and all the cheese. Heck yeah! I ain't saying traveler. I'm gonna find my sister and tell her to never go to Inazuma. I'll I'll sell, I'll tell her to go to Newark, New Jersey first. <laughs> At least in Newark, New Jersey, you're free to be an idiot. Whereas here, you're oppressed to be perfect. Get that flower. Ella. Let me mine those rocks real quickly. Oops, wrong character. There we go. I'll catch up. Someone needs to collect the seaweed for food purposes. That. Get that. He'll hell. We'll tell her to go to Camden. Before we go to Inazuma? Yes. Literally anywhere else. That's way too small. <laughs> it makes me think of Atsuko. Who's that? I'm gonna say Can't that. Can't be helped, I'm afraid. I this don't is remember the who that is. And sturdiest boat that I can provide. It's built from the finest Inazuman timber. Still, I'll be the first to admit that if he's planning to ride this into the storm, it's going to be exceedingly dangerous. I'm also hoping Sakajiro won't have to use it. It's just there as a last resort. Or he can pull a Moana and just, you know, as long as you don't break the boat and you fare through it, you get your head knocked out, you're, I guess, away. I gotta say, though, Kuichi, it feels like your craft has improved once again. <laughs> I'm not the one you should be praising. It's all thanks to the guys who kindly pitched in. To avoid detection, we each worked on our own materials separately, then assembled them secretly in the night. This is the largest we could afford to build. Any bigger, and there's no way it would pass the Tenryo Commission's inspection. Let's store the boat here for now, then. I'll fill Sakajiro in when I get back. He'll need to make some preparations before setting sail. Uh-oh. Paimon feels really worried all of a sudden. Uh... Helping Sakajiro make you a collaborator in the eyes of the Tenryo Commission? <laughs> Maybe it does, but I knew what I was getting into from the moment I agreed to help him. My family has pretty good connections with the Yashiro Commission. We work very closely with them, and whenever there's a national event of any sort, the other two commissions come to us too. As long as I'm polite and respectful and don't cause a fuss, they won't look to cause trouble for me either. And anyway, to your point about collaboration, you've been helping out too, right? That's true. This was all a collaborative effort. Wait! Oh, oh no! We were chased by the Minolith in Liwa too. Ah, so you're seasoned crooks already, eh? Don't know what I was worried about then. <laughs> anyway, thanks for having Hey, don't call out our criminal history. You can't help but be a thug. So just go pick them up from my house whenever you want. While you're there, you can get my pops to settle the boat construction fees. Oh, don't worry about paying anything. Third sis would be sure to scold me if she found out I'd taken Mora from the Naganoharas. Who's third sis? Oh, uh, let me explain this one. It's a story my pops told me. There used to be a thriving merchant guild in Inazuma. It got really prosperous. At one point, there were a dozen or so kids born around the same time to the families of the guild. They all grew up together, each of them learning their respective family's business. They were a tightly knit group of friends, but eventually, they all grew up and decided they each wanted to go into business themselves. It was inevitable that business would send them all to different corners of the world, and that they'd have far less opportunity to see each other in the future. That's right. 
Just before we went our separate ways, the eldest of the group suggested that we should all go watch some fireworks together one last time. <laughs> they were all very ambitious types, and each had their own knack for doing business. One by one, they left, until Koichi was the only one of them remaining in Inazuma. After that, he hardly saw them. But, whenever one of them did come back to visit, fireworks would always be involved. Ooh. Yeah, no matter how close you and your friends are, there's always gonna be s some distance after being separated for a long time. But as soon as the fireworks lit up the sky, it'd instantly take us right back to our childhood, and we'd be chatting away like in the old days. To us, those memories are eternal. Oh, so this is what you meant when you were talking about commemorating things. Yep, that's exactly right. That's nice. That's, why that's I can't actually let sweet. Down when they're counting on me for their fireworks. Anyway, I need to go update Sakujiro. See you, Koichi. Thanks again for your help. Yeah, I should get out of here too. I don't want to get caught red-handed. Bruh. Hmm? What happened? Okay, story time. So, oh. whenever Koichi brings one of his friends from the trade association to see me, they always mention how they used to play with me when I was a kid, or held me once as a baby, or something. Wait, what happened? There Did I miss so something? many of them in that friendship group, man. I'm gonna teleport here. Yeah, I'm sorry. I didn't see what it was you wrote. Cause yeah, I don't I don't read giant blocks time, of text. He shows up with another one of his friends, and the friend asks me if I remembered him. Is she still well, talking? Like, yes, I do. You held me once when I was just a baby. Koichi just bursts out laughing and says, actually, this is one of his carpenter friends. Turns out he's a lot younger. The boat is already and waiting. I'll mark the location for you on the map. Before you leave, I recommend that you pack some food and water. You can never be too prepared. Yo, and Mia Traveler, do you ever feel like a plastic bag? Drifting through the wind, wanting to start again. Oh my god, don't even. Oh, that name. That that freaking song's name is Fireworks. Oh my god, uh, <laughs> no. Uh, after how much effort it took to get back in, it's hard to convince myself to leave again. Especially when I'll be going up against the stormy ocean on a tiny little boat. My prospects don't look great. Well, they won't look much better if you get caught by the Terrio Commission. I'm afraid that sooner or later yeah. they are going to find you here. Time is starting to run out. I'm sorry. I'll make sure to get out of here before they come. I promise I won't cause you and your family any more trouble. I didn't mean it like that. If we ever ran into any problems, I'm sure I'd figure something out. But if the Tenryo Commission does catch up to you, they make a run for the boat. Okay, I won't let them catch me. But... <sighs> No, uh, I guess this whole trip was a waste in the end. Why did you want to come back to Inazuma anyway? Is there something you wanted to do? I didn't used to like this place at all. That's why I left. But looking back on things now, I was really just running away from my responsibilities. Once I started to realize that, I got restless. I couldn't stop thinking about the people and the things I'd left behind. So I... Oh, forget it. What does it matter now? It's too late anyway. I originally wanted to make up for all my regrets, but instead, I found myself in the situation I'm in now. What a pity. Talk to us about it! Maybe we could... If only there was no Sakoku decree, huh? Anyway, uh, don't worry. We're not going to bother you about it. We'll keep trying to buy you as much time as possible until you reach your final decision. The Tenryo Commission. If only they weren't so overzealous, there might be a way. Oh, that's right! That elderly couple, old customers huh? of ours, their son's in the Tenryo Commission, isn't he? Yeah, quite high up as well. That's it. I'll go talk to them. Maybe they can do something. She talks um, so fast! Like she's gonna sure sell me something at auction. Instead? Oh, don't worry about that. They're really nice people. I know them well. They won't cause us any issues. All right. You should get back indoors, Sakujiro. We'll be back in no time at all. Okay, let's go! Time waits for no one! Wait, hang on. What about the fireworks? All those materials? Oh, there's so many orders to finish. Pots! Pots! 
No, never mind. <gasps> I know! I'll write him a note telling him to sort out the fireworks. Write the note and hold it to his face. Why did you cut Paimon off? Why did you cut Paimon off? Because what he... Oh, they're still talking? <laughs> no, Sakajiro, this place sucks. You were right. I know, right? I don't even know why you thought to come back. This place is not good. Oh, I remember these people. Oh no, they're different, they're different, they're different. Well, if it isn't Yoi Mia, come on in, dear, come and take a seat. Are these two your friends? Yes, they're travelers from afar. Outsiders have a very difficult time getting into Inazuma nowadays. Indeed, these are unprecedented times. But seeing as they came all this way, we locals should give them a warm welcome. Hmm. Oh, look at that one kid hopping! I brought the fireworks that you ordered. <laughs> oh, thank you, dear. Your family is so good to us every year. First your father, and now you. I wonder if I'll still be around to see the next hair of Naganahara fireworks. Of course you will. You're both in great health. Don't say things like that. It's bad luck. We aren't as young as we once were, though. The body knows it. It used to be that I could spend all day working the land, carrying water back and forth. But now, even a moment of light work leaves me with all sorts of aches and pains. I wanted to do some weeding yesterday, but as soon as I bent down to get started, I suddenly felt that if I went any further, I wouldn't be able to get back up again. No worries. Say no more. We'll handle it. No, no, no. We can't be putting you to work when you're a guest in our home. I'll just go fetch the tea and some snacks, and then we'll continue our conversation. It's fine. It's not like it's the first time I've helped you with chores. I just haven't had much time recently with the fireworks show coming up. But once that's out of the way, I'll be sure to come by more often. Aww, it's no she trouble. helps her community. Really? I like it. Mind helping. Oh, you're such good kids. As for mine, he's all grown up now. Hasn't found anyone yet. And he doesn't visit very often. Uh, if you're quite sure it's no trouble, then... I have some pickled radish here. Would you mind delivering it to Satoru on the other side of the village? Sure. It won't take us a moment. The old folks aren't very mobile, so come on, let's help them out. We'll get rid of the weeds first, and then deliver the pickled radish. Sounds good to me. Alright, so... What is this here? Oh, I just... Oh! I'm a good weeder. Uh... Yes. Yeah. Nang, nang! Oh, I'm not even hitting the thing. Yeah, you got it! And that should just about do it. Satoru is on the other side of the village. Let's go see him now. What's that? Looks like a story or something. What does this say? Oops! I can't do- I can't walk bridges, it's fine. Hey, Satoru! How have you been? Keeping well? Yeah, same as usual. Not much has changed. You're looking full of life, as always. All thanks to the support of our loyal customers. The family business just keeps getting better and better. We sold some fireworks to Liu a while back, and word is, they were a real hit. So it looks like we'll be getting more business from over there in the future. That must mean a lot more work for you, though. Are you sure you and Mr. Ryunosuke can manage? If it gets too much, I don't forget, you can always ask me for help, hmm? We should be fine. I, I like his accent. Oh, yeah. Um, this is some pickled radish from Mrs. Imatani. 
Oh, wow, thank you so much. I never used to be a fan of pickled radish, would you believe? But then I'd try some of Mrs. Imatani's homemade stuff and I couldn't get enough of it. It's a family staple now. Speaking of your family, how's everyone doing? They're doing well. We have the occasional heated argument, but I guess that's every family ever. Being close to family is better than never getting to see them. Even if it does mean putting up with some conflict. Now, Mr. and Mrs. Imatani seem to have a great relationship. But still, they must get lonely with their child never visiting. Huh, they didn't seem that way to me. I think they're just used to it. I'm gonna be real. This quest line's boring. You make a good point. We're just though. doing chart. We're just doing chores. Future. That way, they won't get so bored. Oh, I'm sure. I was promised a fireworks that. show. all of us in Konda Village. You're always welcome here. <laughs> Thank you. Like literally, I'm glad she's all for the community, but at this point, it's getting saccharine, and I want like. Now, Literally, I feel like the boyfriend being dragged around. About like, I know it's all leading up towards trying to help this guy, but it's like, literally, like, bruh. Incoming. I wanna. Uh, no, I wanted to get to your that roof! quick! Ah, oh, young people are so handy. <sighs> Younger people have bundles of energy, and older people have a wealth of wisdom. Each have their strengths. Speaking of youth. Do you know what? It's been 50 years this year. Oh, so it has. Goodness, how the time flies. You barely notice as the years go by, but then suddenly 50 years have passed. 50 years since what? Some important day? <laughs> the day we get to do stuff? Well, if you must know, it was 50 years ago, back in the days when this young lady was still trying to win me over, that... Oh, stop trying to impress them. Ah. <laughs> we both know you were the one who was hopelessly smitten and desperately trying to win my. Ew, the boomer's gonna shag. I like well, that they're all lovey dovey. Right. <laughs> but I'm like, 50 years ago, let's get I on with to it. My wife at the Naganahara fireworks show. We've been together ever hey, since. Hey, Yashigai, hello, hello. What is up? You should be very proud of what you have. Mm, to tell the truth, I was still a little uncertain. How you doing? I wasn't sure what I was doing when I walked into the Naganahara's shop. Like literally, right now, I'm firework. like neutral face, like even crossing as it was my rising arms up into the sky. Uh, I still had no clue what I was going to say. But then it exploded. The sky lit up. I looked back at her and saw her eyes twinkling in the light of the fireworks. Before I knew what was happening, apparently, I'd already said it. And, well, she'd said yes. Fifty years. In some ways, it's a long time. In others, like this it's quest? no time at all. Really, it's just a number. But fifty years of being together? Now that is something worth commemorating. I'm so I sure. What no idea was your 50th anniversary. If I'd known, I would have made some extra fancy fireworks just for you. Oh no, it's quite all right. We always set off the same firework <sighs> every year. It wouldn't be the same without it. Seeing that firework go off takes us right back to those days. Even at this age, we still look back with not a single regret. What a great relationship they have. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Enough about us, though. Yoimiya, aren't you busy with the fireworks show coming up? Was there something you needed to discuss? Yeah, um, it's a difficult thing to talk about, but here goes. Um. Get it to put it on my head. Sakujiro. So me. he came back. Huh? Oh, did he finally get you to the story? Him? He was our boy's best friend when Finally! They were something related! <sighs> okay. They were inseparable. They grew up together, shared everything with each other, and went everywhere together. But one yeah, day, okay. they had a terrible argument. Sakujiro seemed to feel that Inazuma was too peaceful, and wanted to see what the outside world was like. 
But our I got bling bling. took after his father and mother. He felt bling that bling. there was nothing wrong at all with being peaceful. I like my bling bling. You know what children are like. They get terribly worked up about these sorts of things. In the end, Sakujiro Sad stormed here. off, and that was that. I see. Keisuke said nothing to me or my wife about the fight. We could sense that he was very hurt by it, but he didn't want to talk with us about how he was really feeling. Eventually, whether out of pent-up anger or for some other reason, he yeah. joined the Tenryo Commission. He rarely comes home anymore. If it was anything else, I could talk to Keisuke, and I'm sure he'd be willing to help. But since it's Sakujiro, I don't feel there's any way we can get involved. What a strange coincidence! Who'd have thought? I understand now. When I asked Sakujiro why he came back, he just said because of past mistakes and wasn't willing to elaborate. Now I finally understand why he can't decide what to do. Two best buddies in childhood. One grows up to join the Tenryo Commission, the other grows up to join the Tenryo Commission's most wanted list. I'm so bored! Well, no worries. If that's the case, then never mind. We can find some other way to help Sakujiro. There's no need to make things difficult for you. This sounds like something for Sakujiro and Keisuke to resolve between themselves. Yes. Oh, it'd be so nice if they could go back to the way things were. I think after all these years, they ought to let go of their grudges. I don't know what they're grudging over, I'm gonna be honest. Well, can't say we didn't try. So we came here to do chores. Great. I'm so glad we came here. We got a history lesson. I'll let Sakujiro know after we get back. I, I don't know. Why did they fight? I don't know. I, 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 I zoned the F out of that con. <laughs> I'm just doing this because the game literally won't let me do the story. <laughs> Yoimiya, something bad's happened. Finally! Some people from the Tinryo Commission came by. Huh? Why? Do they know? Pops, are you alright? They didn't do anything to you, did they? I told them the show was starting soon and the place was filled with fireworks, so they shouldn't go in because it's a fire hazard. But they didn't listen. It seemed like they knew Sakujiro was inside. Oh. Luckily, Sakujiro heard them coming in time and managed to escape through the window. The Tenryo Commission wasn't able to capture him. Oh, this is bad news. I don't think Sakujiro had enough time to make his mind up. Pops, did you see where he went? Oh, the Tenryo Commission will definitely be chasing after him. Did you catch any names? Good point. Names. We need names. Suddenly showing up like this, surely it must be Case Case doing. The Commission wouldn't normally cause this big of a fuss over a stowaway. Oh, sorry, my ears are no good. And I didn't get a good look at them either. If you're wondering which way they went, they left the city. I wish I'd caught their names. Oh, but I didn't hear a thing. As it happens, I did. I was Whoa. getting some ore from my friend's place and happened to bump into them on the way over. I think their leader's name was Keisuke, just like you said. Just as I thought. Thanks. If Sakujiro still hasn't made up his mind, those two running into each other won't solve anything. And even worse, there'll be no coming back from it for Sakujiro. We can't let that happen. Come with me. Let's track them down. Am I finally able to do stuff now? Instead of cutting weeds and delivering pickled radish? That would be pretty neat. It's Mosuzaka and his friends. Let's ask them. What do you want, children? Hi, Yoimiya. Are the weapons to scare away the great Mujina yokai ready yet? Oh god, not that oh, again. Oh, uh, Mr. Ryunosuke is making them right now. You can go collect them from my house later. Uh, aren't you gonna play with us, Yoimiya? I'm sorry. I have something important to do right now. I'll be back later on. 
But I'll bring you guys some candy next time. The extra sweet candy, the one you guys love. Yeah! Hey, we're gonna get candy! Woohoo! Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah! Uh. Candy! Woohoo! Also, I wanted to ask you guys something. Uh, did you see a bunch of scary looking men come by here at all? Yep, we did. It looked like they were chasing someone. Are they trying to catch a monster too? No, don't worry. It's all just a big misunderstanding. Be good kids and stay out of trouble, all right? Stay in the city for now, and I'll come play with you after the fireworks start. We will. We'll be on our best behavior, especially for you, Yoimiya. All right, cool, cool, cool. It looks like this is the right way. Let's keep going. If Sakujiro still hasn't made up his mind, I guess I'll have to step in. Look! There are people from the Tenryo Commission over there! It must be them! I'll play. Oh, we Sorry, don't fight? Sorry, official business. I can't let you pass. Sakujiro and Keisuke are up ahead, right? We need to talk to them about something. Didn't you hear me? You're not getting past. Ugh, what a nuisance! <sighs> Well, you've only got yourself to blame! Finally! Some action! God damn! No, let's shine their shoes a little. <laughs> with sword comes shadow. I'm not fighting with you, Yoimiya. You you thoroughly annoyed me today. No time to lose. You're not down yet? I must withdraw. Oh, no you're still up. I must withdraw. Oh, uh, can I ult? Oh, I don't have my ult up yet. Whoops. I'm gonna be honest, that was covered on my part. Leave it all to me. As a dutiful maid would. I must withdraw. Hey. Finally. How dare you impede the work of the Tenryo Commission? I'm happy now. You will be punished for your actions. There is nowhere you can escape justice. Not even at the edges of the world. Wah, wah, wah. Look at that. The one with the loudest mouth had the fastest feet. <laughs> we can't Got waste any more time on these guys. Let's push on. They should be just ahead. Yeah. Hi, Ryder. What is up, Frando? Yeah, it's been almost a week. Heck yeah, we've been doing. You know, Your skills path? with the sword have stagnated, Sakujiro. You should have known that you stood no chance against me in a duel. I never imagined I'd fall into your hands. I, if this is to be my fate, I accept it. I have nothing else to say. But your return says that you finally came around to my point of view. Whatever you say. You will return with me to the Tenryo Commission to await your sentencing. The one who made this boat will also be punished. Wait! It doesn't have to end like this! Don't you have anything else to say to one another? Hey, I know you. You're Naganahara's girl, who makes the fireworks. <laughs> I know you like to get involved in other people's business, but stay out of this. It does not concern you. It's okay, Yoimiya. The past is the past. Then why did you risk life and limb to get yourself back into Inazuma? And why were you so reluctant to leave after you got here? I'll tell you why. This is why. This is the chance you've been waiting for. To talk everything through. Yeah, and explain I why. I have nothing to say to him. He's a criminal. I work for the Tenryo Commission. There is never any room for discussion. Out of respect for the friendship we once had, I gave him a chance to fight for his freedom. But his skills with the sword are as disappointing now as they ever were. 
What are you talking about? And just who do you think you're kidding? You left all your subordinates back there to guard the road, making sure no one else followed you here. Seems to me like you were hoping for a chance to talk. I can see it in your faces. You both have so much to say. And you're Mer just gonna choose to keep it all inside? Tuh. Don't flatter yourself. What would you know? Yo, Mia, leave it. It was just my wish. I know thinking. my name! We don't no, know. I won't leave it! I will not Ooh. stand by and watch when you haven't even done anything! Damn, when Yoimiya's mad, she's mad. But university kicking your ass? I can't imagine, bruh. I cannot imagine. Like, university? Serious? That that's no joke. That is no joke. So, like, I salute you. You're you're gonna make it through. You're gonna make it. I believe. You you will kick universities. Ah yes. Also, hopefully you're doing great. Know my name. Keisuke, you seem to like settling things with a duel, so let's do it your way. I challenge you to a duel. If I win, then you need to say everything that's in your heart. No more running from your feelings. Yeah. And same goes for you, Sakajiro. If I win, you will tell Keisuke exactly why you came back, no matter what the consequences are. You have to tell him everything. If you don't say anything now, you may never have another chance. And if you lose? It won't. You, it won't happen. Then I'll admit to collaborating with Sakujiro and accept the Tenryo Commission's punishment. Yoimiya. <laughs> I accept. Let's settle this with a duel. Sir, we're here to back you up. Back up? Duels are supposed to be one on one! All right, that's it! Let's help Yoimiya! We can't let her fight them all alone! Hey! Uh, Get uh, to the chase! Uh, Don't blame uh, me! Help me! Uh, Don't waste my time! Uh, I must leave uh, no stone unturned! Uh, time to clean up! I must not withdraw. Withdraw. You're more of you. Leave it all to me. I guess I should have fought him first instead of fighting all the other ones, huh? Sir, they are too strong. We need no, I'm gonna use I'm gonna use Kaching with the uh, air animal. What? No, I'm gonna shove the sword up my ass and spin away. around. Now stand <laughs> down. Y yes, sir. Sorry. Young lady, you are just as obstinate as Sakujiro was back then. Why were you so convinced that we had things to say to each other? Also, why am I gonna? Okay. Know my name? Your suggestions are very bad. Um, because why in the hell am I gonna use a Sumeru character in Inazuma if I can't level him up past a certain point? If I didn't need Mizuma, because that is Inazuma, that, not even, that is a Sumeru area. And I'm trying to get everyone, like, sufficiently leveled to at least, you know, make this shit easy. Because it's easy. Because I have every all the talents leveled up. I'm getting the artifact sets, at least, you know, not the best stats, but at least we're getting the set amounts right. Why am I going to be using Dendro? Explain. Because that Dendro character is going to get fucked. Because they're going to be capped at, like, 50. And right now, all my characters are at 70, and I'm trying to get their artifacts up. To get them fully performing. Uh, Child, uh, Tartaglia has, um... None of his artifacts are leveled, but he's still pretty strong. So once his shit, like, gets leveled up, he's gonna be even stronger, because we have a level 70 Atmos that we just upgraded to today. Use Dendro, then Ch- I'm not- they're not gonna- they're gonna be too low level. They're not worth- I'm not in Sumeru. Your- your- your recommendation is bad. It's very bad. 
Duels are supposed to be one-on-one, -on -one, says Paimon with a 4-1 player. Listen. Listen, listen. There may be four people here, but we pull them out one at a time. So, yeah. But, yeah. No, no more bad, no more bad recommendations. Because... Thank you. Sakajiro may not have told me about you when he came back, but he did order a firework from me. Then, your parents told me about what happened between you when you were younger. Once I'd heard the story, I realized that the firework meant something special to you both. And that's why I simply refuse to believe that you have nothing to say to each other. Nobody said If I'm at Endgame, that would make lonely, sense, but I'm not in Endgame. The reason I came back is that... I felt lost. It wasn't that I'd changed my mind, I just felt that what I'd done in the past was to try to escape from reality. I don't even know what he did. <laughs> I saw the freedom of Mondstadt, the contracts of Liyue, the wisdom of Sumeru, and the justice of Fontaine. He had all left a deep impression on me. What did he do again? I was glad that I'd it left It was when my eyes glazed over that I guess they, I they, they mentioned- the Sokoku decree. When, when they brought up what he did, honestly, my eyes glassed over because all I heard was them, the old people, loving each other. Which is great. I like that. But my eyes glossed over. <laughs> I was an escapee. So I don't know I why they thought. That. What I should have tried to do is take the good things from the outside world and bring them back home. So that's why you came back? Out of your naive hope of changing the way things are here. No, I let go of all those delusions of grandeur. I do know, but I'm I not in a point to use it. I never should have run away like that. <sighs> After all, I know how. Away. I know what Dendro is. I know how it works, but I'm in no position to be using it effectively. Because you're essentially telling me to put in a, an element that's going to one be low level for me, and two. Uh, just for what? A quick burst? That's not gonna matter too much because I'm gonna have one really good character. Any any benefit that weakened character is gonna give me just because it's Dendro is not gonna be good because it's not gonna be at the level it's supposed to be. Because it's gonna be cat for me at like 50. So there's no point in bringing it, so it's a bad idea. Like I said, if it was at endgame, I would, I would, well one, I'd be already doing it, but two, I would be listening more, but at this point, no. Huh? That's a very dumb idea. Well, I'd rather have a higher you, level character and have my me. current reactions with the way they are. I just had to come back and go with a sub par character like for one elemental reaction. I couldn't ignore it any longer. That makes no sense. Life isn't easy for anyone. I Not if they're a low level character. The Shogun. Her ideas were my personal creed, and I desired nothing more than to see her will done. Yeah, not if they're a low character, no. Cause I'm not. I'm sorry. I'm not switching out a, a higher level character with higher level talents for a level forty um, yow yow that I have. But now, my role is to punish violators of that's this. That's a very bad. Decree. That's very bad recommendation. And confiscate people's visions. And bad advice. It's not what I signed up for when I joined the Tenryo Commission. I do wonder. Am I really doing the right thing? You're asking a level 40 yow yow to yours. perform at a level 70 range. Uh huh? I couldn't make you stay in Inazuma, but that doesn't mean I want to keep you here by force. Uh, what will you say to the higher ups? Don't worry about that. I'll handle it. I recommend. I understand if you're trying you to help, back, but that's I hear the you're giving bad. You're giving bad to advice. Inazuma from the outside world is long and complicated. And you should be made aware but it can of that. Be done. I will lend you my help, but until then, you'll have to wait. And don't kick the bucket on the way out. Don't worry, Keisuke. I won't. Any chance we can watch the fireworks together? Mm, maybe next time. <sighs> I'll be demoted for sure. It's not like me to give in the childish sentiment like this. You think I have the traveler I leveled? Explain why I went through with it. I do. The Traveler is nowhere near leveled because I don't use the Traveler. Why in the world do you expect me to level him up? Hell no. Especially not his an- He's built more for animal right now. Dude, she's in Inazuma. She's in- I mean, I can travel- Can I just travel to the stone and just worship the thing? 
I don't know if it's going to give me the animo thing, but... Again, I understand you're trying to help, but don't give blind cookie cutter advice to because it's not going to always help everybody. Yes, Dendro is uh, good for the bloom and the quicken and all that. Yeah, I know. I understand. But I'm in no position to use them right now. And it doesn't even matter because, honestly, I'm doing very good right now with my characters. Because I built them, because I leveled up their talents, and because I'm working on their artifacts. I probably would be doing better if I farm for better artifacts, but honestly, the good right now we're on the right track. But yeah, just just pushing that dendro is good is bad advice from someone that one doesn't have the traveler leveled up, two can't level up the other um, dendro characters I have because they're going to be capped at fifty. It's the one that Sakura anyway. Jiro planned on using for his escape. I asked Yoshitaka and the others to transport it here citing the temporary contraband storage clause. Also, me doing all this, I want to get to Sumeru so I can use Dendro characters, because I know that they're good and that they're fun to play with. Like, literally, I have a team that's consistent of Zhongli, Dendro Daddy, Yaimiko, and I forget the fourth person in there. It might be some... I don't know who it is, but I have... I already have teams ready with Dendros in mind, but I, I'm nowhere... I, I need them to be leveled up to do a good job, and not because blindly Dendro is good, and because the reactions are good. Forcing Sakujiro to this spot was also something I had planned all along. It's like trying to put a star like in, all the, in all the holes. Even though I hadn't fully made up my mind, my actions betrayed my intent. When the holes are all but different shapes. I think you did the right thing. And look, now you've managed to resolve the grievance in your heart by talking about it. Yeah, but I my understand. my traveler isn't leveled up, Thank so you. it won't even matter. I it's going to be the same problem as Yao Yao. You saw right into what I was thinking. <laughs> That's only because I know your parents so well. They're both really nice people, so I didn't think the apple would fall too far from the tree. I had heard there was a new Nagano Hara running things these days. A little loud and reckless, maybe, but... <laughs> You live up to the family name. I do like loud By the and way, Naganohara fireworks can reproduce the firework that the two of us set off back then, right? Would you be able to make one for me? Sorry, no can do. Without the slipper reference, I can't make the same one again. And I'm afraid Sakajiro is the one with the slip. Ah, I see. Oh. Never mind then. <laughs> Don't get too down just yet, though. I mentioned that Sakujiro ordered a firework from me, didn't I? I can't make another one, but I'm guessing Sakujiro probably won't be needing his anymore. It'd be a shame for it to go to waste, so I'll make an exception and let you set it off instead. Thank you very much. Aww. No worries. And don't miss out on the start of the firework show. When are we gonna get to that? I wanna see these fireworks. Yoimiya! The way you took command of that whole situation was amazing! What can I say? I like to talk. I'm a strong believer in the power of words. If you're not willing to communicate, then the problem just sits there. If you just keep staring at it without doing anything, eventually you'll watch every last opportunity to resolve it slip away before your eyes. True! Sakujiro and Keisuke can't turn back the clock in their relationship, but that's no what reason beautiful to live scenery. with remorse. Anyway, follow me. I'll bring you to the perfect place to watch the fireworks. I still don't know what they did. What? what? Allie, do you remember this quest line? What did they fight? Oh, what? Why? Why did they get upset at each other? Because honestly, like I feel like in all that, all that extra fluff about the old people saying, "Oh, my body didn't work the way we're supposed to," or "Oh." We met 50 years ago. Oh, your light streak, your eyes twinkle in the fireworks. And then there's two seconds of blah, 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 something happened. But then we love each other so much. He never visits us. Like, there was like a little, like a little, little smattering of like actual thing that I'm supposed to care about in this story. And it was all buried under caca. It was buried under caca. And now I don't know why they're fighting. I still, don't they didn't even say what it was. Maybe they'll say what it is. I don't even know. Is it over a girl? I don't know. They never said. Yes, it is. The game's forcing me to play her story for me to get through. So, yeah. And it's boring. Boring, boring, boring. There's times it's the duty thing. The duty to what? Get more bitches? <laughs> like, I don't know. I'm like, duty for what? What are you doing duty for? 
Um, also, what were they no? What were they mad at each other for back then? Like duty for what? They were kids. He didn't work at for the for the com for the commission back as a kid. My pops will set off the firework that I wanted to give to you. That's I'm trying to figure out what happened in their childhood. That that is the thing I want to know. I'll catch up. It's like when your friends becomes a cop and catches you. Someone needs assistance. Well, yeah, I understand that now, but what about back then? What was their upset back then? When they were kids, or did not happen when they were kids? I'm confused. I'll catch up. Did the upset happen when they were not kids? Is that what I'm understanding? Because they made it sound like it happened way back in the day when they were kids, but... I don't know. I don't know, if, if, it were, if it wasn't so boring, I would have been paying attention. Oh, that's what it was. Okay, I understand. Really? He's gonna get away while standing in the boat? Huh? Uh. Aww. <gasps> Aww. Now this is actually nice. Oh, it's... <laughs> Aww. <sighs> so, Yumiya, these fireworks, what do they mean to you? Yumiya? Uh, shh. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> That is pretty. I'm not gonna lie. That was amazing! It was so beautiful I could weep. Uh, I didn't actually cry though, right? I just feel a bit misty-eyed. It was very pretty. I would have oh, cried too. Uh, remember that big one that went up first? The gold one? Yeah. That's the one I had Pops make for you. Ooh, I like that one. Oh, Paimon saw it! It was one of the best ones! They won't forget that anytime soon! <laughs> That's what I wanted to hear! I was hoping it would leave a deep impression on you guys. It did! It did! No matter where your journey takes you, and no matter what hardships might lie ahead, I hope you'll always be able to look back fondly on the fireworks you saw tonight. It almost made it worth it. As time goes by, this firework will only grow brighter and more beautiful in your heart. Oh, and also, you're technically my customers now. Here, this is your paper slip. If you ever want to see that golden firework again, just come and see me. Thank you. You know, Yoimiya, you seemed to turn into a completely different person during the fireworks. You were so quiet, and it was like you couldn't hear anything at all. Oh, I can hear you. I just have a habit of being silent while I'm watching fireworks. Quietly watching something you made with your own hands rise into the sky it feels like a sacred ceremony to me. You asked me what fireworks mean to me, right? Yeah. Yep. Well, for Koichi, who built the boat for us, and his friend, Third Sis, fireworks commemorate friendship. For Keisuke's parents, they commemorate marriage. And for Keisuke and Sakajiro, they were commemorating... Hmm... Unwavering beliefs. Oh yeah, right, beliefs! As for me, uh... <laughs> to be honest, uh, even though I've thought about it countless times before, I still haven't found an answer. Seriously? Huh. Paimon was expecting something deep and philosophical. Well, no one's ever asked me this before, so I've never really settled on an answer. It was by chance that I happened to be born into the Naganohara family, so it was by chance that I ended up learning this craft from my pops. It's also by chance that I've met so many people, learned so many things, and discovered that people associate watching fireworks with the things that are most precious to them. Fireworks that disappear in a flash of light are probably the furthest thing away from the eternity that our shogun desires. But people's feelings don't just disappear. 
And it's those feelings that give fireworks their purpose. If nobody wanted to watch fireworks, then they wouldn't exist. Eh, yeah, it's another kind of eternity. Also, consider this. You have to have the Naganoharas because so many people are emotionally invested in the existence of fireworks. If we didn't exist, their wishes would go unfulfilled, wouldn't they? You know, I don't really think about complicated things like this very often. But I'm proud that I was born into the Naganohara family and have the chance to make so many pretty fireworks. Aw. Well, that's adorable. I mean, it dragged on. It dragged on like a, a gajillion years. I felt like I was being... Oh. You were talking? As usual, it's the first stop. Kamori Tea House. Are you ready to head over? Yeah, let's actually get some stuff going. God damn, like it's all... It's being being sentimental, that's cool. I get it. Fireworks mean a lot to people. Blah, 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 blah. But um, can we like... You know. Oh, following day? Alright, so we have to wait. But, you know, it, it, it dragged on. Alright, so now we wait. I only remember fragments. I can understand why. I'm surprised I introduced fireworks into the game. They have you buy in Leeway instead of- <gasps> Yeah, I was gonna ask if you can buy fireworks in a Le in a inner shop. But it's weird that you can't. Alright. So let's go straight to the tea shop now that we're done with all hopefully we're done with the women's and their shopping and their errands. Cause honestly, with with between Ayaka and Iomina Iominas I, I don't even know how to say her name. But between the three between the two of them, I'm like, okay, can, are we done with the women's stuff now? Can we can we go on? I'm tired of shopping at TJ Maxx. Someone needs assistance. I wanna I wanna get some action going. I wanna get some drama. And there was barely any drama in there. It's kind of sad he doesn't talk more, but it's fine, I suppose. Try and make him a blank slate, I guess. How strange. It's never this quiet here. <laughs> Tom is playing his ventriloquist game again, huh? Toma? Toma? <laughs> hey, you can come out now. Paimon's seen you already. Not a peep. Uh, so where the heck is he then? <laughs> huh. What's Kataro Maru so worked up today? I know I so can, but I want to buy good. new and different fireworks. That Hello. happen to be made by me. Have either of you seen Toma? Uh-oh. No, we thought he'd be with you. Why? Has something happened? Then it's as I feared. On the way here, I heard that Toma had been taken away by the Tenryo Commission. I have returned, gamer. I've lost three games of League. I've got nuggies in the oven, and I'm slightly... Ah, <laughs> uh, well, one of those things is good. I don't know. One of those things are bad. The other two are good. Doggo ate Toma. I can believe that. So be sure to be careful while uh, intoxicated near the oven. I wasn't certain whether it was true, so I came right here. The fact that he hasn't arrived here as we arranged suggests that it is true. The Raiden Shogun is holding a vision hunt ceremony at the statue of the omnipresent god today uh -oh. to mark the 100th vision seized under the decree. Oh. And the 100th vision bearer in question, the one who will have their vision seized, I fear, <gasps> is Toma. Now this is what I'm talking about, this drama here. Hold up a second. So the ceremony that Toma said the Tenryo Commission were busy preparing for, that was this vision hunt ceremony? And he was the target all along? I know I'm I know I'm glad I lost two games of league. I needed to be <laughs> humbled from what? I believe so. The Shogun and the Tenryo Commission see the ceremony as a milestone. With the 100th vision, they wish to mark the success of the vision hunt decree to date. This cannot happen. I must go and rescue him. <laughs> but you are were... <laughs> That's actually that's actually pretty good. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. But you are the Sarabba River River. Yeah, like it or not, you represent the whole Yashiro Commission. So if you go and pull a stunt like that, you're basically declaring you and the Raiden Shogun are enemies now, right? 
And by doing it so publicly, you might be implicating a lot of other people from the Yashiro Commission, too. There is no other option. I must act with haste. The ceremony is about to begin. I will not abandon Toma like this. He is my friend. To think that not long ago we were all eating hot pot together. We're gonna say prison break. <sighs> Humbled from life. Oh my god. <laughs> you said so yourself. Let's go. Uh, okay, I'll wait here for your return. Get back safely. Don't worry, Ayaka. A friend's life is on the line. We ain't about to mess this up. Paimon, give me my clock! Time to go into business mode! And then she holds it sideways. <laughs> Time to show them the mean streets that is Paimon! <laughs> ay, 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 ay. Toma, good boy. We about hell yeah. We're gonna, we're gonna save a fan and we're going to give the middle finger. Oh, <gasps> is that the bitch herself? Oh, <gasps> it's the, it's, it's Fidel Castro. But sexy. Sexy Fidel Castro. No, oh, I gotta get up. I gotta fix my chair. Sexy Fidel Castro is here. Using elemental energy without a vision. You are an exception, it appears. Exceptions. The enemy of eternity. When is she gonna become nice? So far, all I see is sexy Fidel Castro taking a sword from her teeth. You will be inlaid upon this statue. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> what the heck's going on? Paimon has a tear tattoo in her eye. Step on me. Oh, we're fighting now? Okay. There is much to verify about you. Oh! Oh, Jesus Christ! Inferior. Oh, she's immune! Fuck! Inferior. It's not like dead! This has now. a good night, Shun. Inferior. I'll catch up. Jeez. Someone Christ. needs assistance. Lightning falls on the land Give of eternity. Up. Oh! I didn't understand what I was supposed to have done. Okay, I understand. I didn't understand what I was supposed to have done. Okay. I must leave. I have probably like the worst. Shouldn't let your guard down. You keep on dodging, you hoe. No time to lose. Probably should eat food or something. Alright, might need to. No, I can't. I know I can! What do you mean? Gone. I need more food. That I'm gonna need. That. 
definitely need this. Need some hash browns. Say, cause all she does is just keeps dodging my shit. That's right, take that bitch. Are you just gonna endlessly just like this stuff? Huh? I can't use my burst? Oh! Bitch! I can't use my burst! Really? Cheater! Am I, I need her! I need her for healing! Bitch, you're cheating! Fine. I have to keep my distance. Strike dead. You are such a little cheater. Freaking bitch. Alright, now that I understand she locked my shit. Directly. <laughs> Commendable. She's a cheater. Wake up, wake up! She plays unfair. No fear, that should have been me! Stop simping! <laughs> Hell yeah, Noelle's a queen, but, you know, when you- Actually, the only person that can do stuff if, if they're locked from their abilities is a Ningguang. Shogun, who was that? Seize him under the decree. Huh? Next time. <sighs> I will strike twice. <laughs> so, Allie, when does the whole she's nice thing comes in? Because right now, she's nothing but a, but a raging biatch. Why have we stopped here? In case you've forgotten, the Kamore Tea House is the safest place for me to hide in this area. The only thing is, I probably won't be able to leave again for some time. I'll have to leave the next steps to you. What do you want us to do, bro? Go to Tatarasuna and find the resistance. The Shogun's army is almost certainly about to issue a warrant for our arrest. There are very few parties that will be willing to show I'm not telling you because, ah, spoilers. Got it, exception. got it. Paimon's pretty sure Ayaka mentioned them before. Oh, yeah! Sunken Amiya's group, the ones who came together to fight the Vision Hunt Decree. That's right. The Resistance was founded by Sango no Miya Kokumi, the Divine Priestess of Watatsumi Island. Oh! Currently, it's her subordinate, Goro, Fish girl. who leads them in their war <gasps> against the Shogun's army. However, We're the Yashima Commission is not on especially close terms with the Resistance, mm. so your dealings with us would normally be frowned upon. <laughs> but you're different, so that shouldn't work against you. As far as I can see, the Resistance shouldn't have any reason to turn you away. The only issue is that we can't be sure of the Resistance Force's current location. You'll have to ask around along the way. You'll likely pass through territory occupied by the Shogun's army at some point, so be sure to stay on your guard at all times. You do the same, bro. <laughs> Don't worry about me. I can remain hidden when I want to. I won't make it easy for them. We gotta hurry up! The Tenryo Commission could be right around the corner! Let's get out of here! Yeah. Let's see now I just how do I how do I follow? Where's my guide glitters? Oh, I go over here. Okay. Alright. And they say there's a Oh. Uh. Hmm. Ah, oh, I don't feel like doing that. I just feel like doing story. 
Fuck, I should've never picked up League again. Yeah, never, don't touch it, don't touch it, because it is very addictive. If you if you break its clutches, don't go back, because it will have a death hold on your on your soul and spirit. And it'll suck every little bit until there's nothing left but a husk. Or what I've always gotten. Yeah. I'll catch up. Lapos. <sighs> I heard they added a couple more people to the wanted list. They're high priority targets, apparently. But most of our forces are out on the front line. How are we supposed to effectively prioritize them? <sighs> we'll just have to make sure we keep our eyes peeled when we're out on patrol. <sighs> hmm. I wonder how they're faring on the front line. Last thing I heard was that we'd push the resistance back to just northwest of Musojin Gorge. I don't know if that's true. I doubt it. Their rear guard isn't far from there. We're gaining ground at the moment, but I don't think we pushed them back that far. Anyway, we should focus on patrol. Come on, we're up. <sighs> Fair point. <clears throat> Time to go to work. The northwest of Musojin Gorge. So that's where the resistance forces are based. We should keep asking around, though, just to be safe. Oh, Rose, you missed it. We we ran into Raiden Shogun, and hey, surprise, she's a bitch. <laughs> also, I have a Sucrose. I'm not happy about it. I don't use her. I don't use Animal, but, you know, she has her uses. I know they're, like, they're staunt, like, believers in Sucrose, but, you know, I'm not one of them. Sorry, I couldn't, couldn't hear you over queuing for another League game. <laughs> yeah, I know, Rosa is very boring. The Iomiya storyline, bleh. No. But now actual story is happening, and we're gonna run to Goro. I love Goro, he's so cute. And we're gonna run into one of the best healers in the game, Kokomi. Probably shouldn't go that way. I need her for crowd control. Ah. Yeah, I know she's very, very meta. I'm also excited to see her card come into the TCG game. Papa! Death from above. Oh hey, you managed to escape too. Yeah. Meta Where hated Coco when she released. Geeky Village. Did I've they heard actually? the rumors, but it's still got to be a safer place than a war zone. What about you? Uh, don't get me started. I was recuperating on Nozuchi Beach. It's complete chaos over there. The resistance aren't having an easy time of it. They don't have the manpower for an all-out confrontation, so they can't contend with the Shogun's army. The front line used to be further forward, but they had to retreat a couple of times. Now they're back to Nizuchi Beach. And that's where I've just come from. I was lucky to get out. It's much too dangerous. Their forces are so I like that I'm scattered just standing that no one there. knows who's who, and anyone you run into pulls Meta their hates weapon. everything? True. I just dropped my luggage and ran here. Except Raiden. It I sucks her off. I think we need off. to keep moving. Things are changing so fast. The further away we can get, the better. Agreed. Why don't we stick together? Can't hurt to team up with someone. Nazuchi Beach. Sounds like that's where the Resistance and the Shogun's army are battling it out right now. Let's head over and take a look. Heck yeah. I want to get into some scuffles. Now because they love Dendro? Exactly. Yep, 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 yep. Now, due to the new Dendro Archon, they're gonna suck off Dendro as much as possible. Pretty much whenever there's a new Archon release, expect that to be sucked off. And I'm assuming, I think it's, I think Water is the next one? Water is gonna be the next, uh, Archon in Fontaine. So I'm assuming that they're gonna have, I mean, it's already leaning heavily towards Hydro, but it's gonna be super extra whenever that Archon comes out. Also, hello! Oh my god, it's Lucifer Morningstar. You are not referencing that frickin' show. Oh my god, I love it. That show is just so good. I think around, I, unfortunately, the time I started watching it, it just got cancelled. And I know they did stuff on it with Netflix, but I'm not sure if it's worth watching, because I've heard some mixed things. Do you think it's worth watching on Netflix? Where'd she go? Oh. It's nothing. 
This is Her Majesty's gift! Speed of light! Huh? Leave it all to me! <laughs> Don't waste my time! Winter. I don't need to move, but... Oh, never mind. We're fine. Same thing's gonna happen with Deha. They're gonna hate her, but then when it comes out, she'll be on top. Right now, I'm, I'm still meh. Ooh, let's get that, because it's there. I have joined here just to see how all my minions are doing. We are doing amazing. Amazing. Nothing but tits, ass, and good vibes. Nothing less. For the Lucifer Morning Star. Better watch it. <laughs> I gotta. Rem I, here's the problem. The problem is, is that I don't want to rewatch stuff I've already seen, but I've forgotten a lot of it. So I'm, I'm in that weird middle ground of I want to watch it, but at the same time, like I won't remember what to skip. Nowhere to hide. So that's like my weird middle ground. <laughs> Give up. And I gotta, I gotta figure out. But thank you for the follow. Thank you, thank you. I must leave no stone unturned. As a dutiful maid would. To the fairy. Yeah. All in a day's work. I gotta remember where I even left off. I think the last I remembered, like he just got his wings back or something like that. I think that's the last I remember. There was something involving wings. That's all. That's that's the last that my memory served me. Hell yeah, I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. I salute you. How you doing, Rift? Hello. Someone needs assistance. How are you doing this fine evening? I mean, I kind of got my my cooch cooked kicked in by riding, but what are you gonna do? I mean, some people enjoy that. I'm not naming names, Allie, but I'm just saying some people enjoy getting their cooch kicked in by riding. And one of those people are definitely not me. Hey! I am- I don't- I don't enjoy it. It is not the best for me. No fair? What do you mean, no fair? <laughs> Listen, for some people that sounds like a dream. To me, it's just it's just inconvenient and annoying. <laughs> also, do you play Gunshin Morningstar in YouTube Rift? Who are your teams? I'll catch up. Oops. La -da -da. Right. Oh no, bad things are. Ha oh, I need to collect this flower. Hey, look! Do you think that's a resistance fighter? Don't waste my time. You can block all you want, but at the end of the day, my shit's still gonna hurt you. It's nothing. I need to train harder. Bested. You saved me. I thought I was about to die. Who's Thank your you team? Thank you so much for your help. I'm Tepe of the Gobius Platoon. I'm with the Resistance. I was sent to the front line just recently. I, I was looking forward to doing my part. Instead, it seems I fell at the first hurdle. So, uh, you aren't dressed like Resistance fighters. Have you come here looking to sign up? Yes. Great. Just the other day, I heard General Goro complaining about how desperate we are for more people. I love Your Goro. I can't wait to run into him. Difference. I'll escort you back to our camp. But first, let me bring you up to speed on our current situation. As you can see, the Resistance are at a constant disadvantage when it comes to open confrontation. The goal of the Shogun's army is to uphold eternity. To this end, they have the support of the Tenryo Commission's general, Kujo Sara, who commands an exceptionally strong force. As for us... Vision bearers are few and far between as it is. And because of the Vision Hut decree, they're rarer than ever. 
The fact we're even able to hold out is thanks to the brilliant strategic mind of Her Excellency, Sangonomiya. We're also indebted to the great courage shown by General Goro and the Resistance troops. <sighs> if only I had a vision myself. Not only would I be better placed to share Her Excellency and General Goro's burden, but I'd be able to hold my own on the battlefield too. Aww. I couldn't help but notice that you used elemental energy when saving me just now. You must have a vision yourself? Nope. He's a special case. He doesn't have a vision, but he can control the elements anyway. Are you serious? That's... incredible! I, I guess that means you're immune to the Vision Hunt Decree. You have to let me introduce you to General Goro. Yes. He'll welcome you with open arms. I want to meet Perhaps the boy. Perhaps I can also make a worthy contribution Viva this Viva la resistance! Of course, I'd much oh, rather prove back. my worth by the sword. If only taking down Shogunate Samurai was as easy as you make it look. Official... But Beidou, Singchu, and Haizo. I don't know who the last one is, but I like those three. That's very good. Oh, welcome back. So I was asking, do you play Genshin and who's your team? Anyway, we shouldn't delay. Let's I like learning about people's teams. I tried making Fischl a part of my thing, but it just... Oh, I need to go to this part of the... No. Yeah. Yeah. Heck yeah. Unfortunately, I'm going to be forced to be a Beidou lover because I have her at C1 already. And I wasn't even trying to pull for her. Got some people. And got no clue. Honestly, the exact same. Um, usually, it's good to... Um, Beidou mid. Oh, you better be careful. There's some staunch Beidou lovers in these parts. I'm just saying for the record. Here's the thing, for me, I also had no idea what I was doing. But honestly, just play the characters you like. And then if, if you want to know how to build them, just look up stuff online. It's very easy. Yeah. Follow the cookie cutter until you get your own your own feet, because that's what I did. Because when I first joined and played this, I was so lost. I didn't know what I was doing. I mean, I still kind of don't know what I'm doing. I'm, I'm still winging some parts. But there's some stuff I do understand and have a grasp of. It's just a matter of getting to the end game to utilize all the knowledge. Which I am- Oops! How did I- how did I drown in, like, knee-deep water? That should not have counted. Give up. Go up here. Let's see over here. Huh? Don't play. Oops. <laughs> Choices were made. Why didn't he get thrown off? Why did I get thrown off but he didn't? What are you made of, cement? Right. Speed of light. Leave it out to me. I don't know why you're so thick, but whatever. Probably switch at the wrong time, but whatever. I didn't drop anything, do I? Let me see, who did you have? I got Mona. Same, the guy who can't solo Oven it. Oh my god. I got Mona, Beto, Catboy. Aw, you got Goro? Or is it Tinaru? The guy from Samaru. Why was the first word I hear back when Nuggies was feet? That, that's more like a self-tell, I don't know about that. Hey, hey, I still load Oceanid. Just takes a bit of time and strategy. Don't go, Badoom. Is Mona good? Um, people say she's good. I personally do not vibe. But I can understand why she's good. If you build her, if you build her slash anyone, they're good, true. 
just want to make it to the to the statue. But yeah, literally, just be sure to level up your artifacts, which is the stuff you equip them to, and you're fine. She got a dump. <laughs> I mean, honestly, that's the reason why people play most of the characters they play. So honestly, respect. Also the play style, but m looks come. For form, but for function, is how Genshin players play. Let's just be real, real. Well, let's not joke or let's not kid ourselves. The dumpy is what her DPS, her DPS is EMP. A person of culture, I see. Of course, it's Lucifer Morningstar, of course they're cultured. <laughs> Let me get this freaking statue. Give them all the stuff we got. Oh, I thought it would be more. Well, I haven't really been in the Inazuma area too long. I'm more everywhere else but there. Speed of light. It's nothing. What did I do? I don't understand what's happening. I'm just getting struck by lightning. Just repeatedly. Also, here's something I did not know. Um, I honestly did not know that the statue healing was limited. Like, I never got to the point where I ran out of statue healing. Which I find very strange, because um, I watched a video- Oh, I see the thingy up there. I saw a video about Necrit talking about the statue had limited healing, and I was like, what? I never ever reached that cap. And I used to use the statue literally all the time just to heal. But like for little things. We all have the reasons for the characters we use, true. I can show you Moe's power. I know Moe's powers, but I don't care for her and her playstyle. Because I like the DPS and the stuff that the characters I have do. Like literally, there's nothing that Mona can't do that I can't get from other people. Aw, thank you for the invite to the Discord. Aw, thank you. We're welcome to have you. We talk fun memes and stuff and news and all the random things. And you can cuss in there. Because I didn't know that... Honestly, why didn't no one tell me they could curse in the general chat? I had no idea. I, I, I wish I knew so I could have turned that off faster. Alright, let's go meet the boy. <laughs> Oh, but first, let's get this waypoint. Get the waypoint. <gasps> thank you for the follow -up. Thank you, thank you, Lala! Can I jump over this fence? No, I cannot. But I will get this floaty fui fui and the waypoint. Jesus. Every other word I say is a curse word. <laughs> Wait, you can't- No, you can! I didn't know you- Before you couldn't, but that's because I didn't know, like, Discord has some shit that's turned on automatically that, I guess, protects from, like, commonly used curse words. And that was stupid. And so, I turned it off today. So I liberated y'all. Call me the deliverer. Call me the savior. I delivered you from the- the niceness of not being able to cuss. No swears. Oh, it's. F I mean, I don't. I wouldn't say it's Christian. Just you know, it's just a. It's a gremlin den. Oh, thank you for the follow. Uh, me cuss. Me cu Me cussy. Is that? Oh my god. <laughs> Love the name. Miko, <laughs> is that? <supposed> <gasps> okay, okay. Don't freak out. Don't freak out. Don't freak out. Don't freak out. It's, it's the boy. 
It's the boy. Okay. All right. Don't freak out. It's okay. 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 I no longer get yelled at by discard. You always have to seize the opportunity while it's It's the boy. Everyone, shut up and pay attention to the boy. This is what happened, General Goro. I was surrounded by Shogunate Samurai, and the they came boy. to my rescue. They can use the elements without a vision. The Resistance could really use people with that kind of skill. We should bring them in. Hmm. <clears throat> I presume you've heard that the goal of the Resistance is to defeat the Shogun's army and repeal the Vision Hunt Decree. I'm gonna be for real. I never heard this man speak. That's not the voice I expected to get from him. Let's just continue. This is no easy task. Each who sets foot on the battlefield must be ready to sacrifice their life. Tell me, why do you wish to join us? The Resistance cannot accept any who don't possess a warrior's will. You and I must be certain of your decision. I don't know. This 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 voice is a choice. This voice is a choice. It's a dog. You can tell from the paw right there. That's a doggy paw. You should check. I will. After stream, I will. I'm so excited to see what you put. Should we go inside? It's kind of raining and lightning. Oh, be disappointed. I'm. I'm. Let's let's give it time to cook. Let's give him time to cook. This guy, dog bite. Yeah. I don't know. It's hard to take him seriously with those them ears and that collar. So about the hundred vision. You're referring to the ceremony to mark the one hundredth vision seized under the decree, right? Yes, we received some news of it here, despite it taking place over in Inazuma City. There was a disturbance, allegedly. Highly unusual, considering that the Raiden Shogun appeared in person. Uh, but why do you wish to discuss this all of a sudden? Unless you have some information to share. Tw oh, there's another doggy paw right there. Twas me. What? Yep. We had a fight with the Raiden Shogun and everything. Then we grabbed the Vision Bearer and whisked him off to safety. After that, they added us to the army's wanted list. That's why we came here. Hmm. Now that you mention it, we did just recover a bounty notice from a Shogunate Samurai defeated in battle. It read, Reward for the capture of a blonde-haired traveler and their mysterious flying pet. <laughs> so this refers to you two? I mean, what? Who are they calling a mysterious flying pet? Uh oh, don't get fire on. Don't, don't have her get her, I her, her your talking pistol. Well enough for now. On behalf of the resistance, welcome to our ranks. When Paimon wants to talk to you, she pulls out the talking pistol. <laughs> it helps her talk. Her Excellency is currently hurt. away from the camp. We don't know where she went, but she instructed us to take care of everything in her absence. I will ask Tepe here to show you around the camp first. Me? And then dispatch you straight to the front line. If you're ready, of course. I'm about to pop a cap. I use OBS, why do you ask? But I do use the Streamlab bot to, you know, moderate things. Long, viva la resistance! Yes, sir. I used to be in the logistics division, so I'm the right person to show you around. I know the setup like the back of my hand. I'll make sure you get a warm resistance welcome. Let's start with the field hospital. Some of my friends are recovering there. Last time I saw them, I promised that I'd introduce any new recruits. When they're finally back on the battlefield alongside us, we'll all be brothers in arms. Big Harden? What are you talking about? Is this a new recruit? Looks like a strong addition. No wonder to you're too. getting sick. You're standing Hopefully in the rain. I can spar with after I've recovered. Whoa, whoa! Brand new recruit, and your first thought is to start sparring with them. You're getting ahead of yourself. That wound of yours isn't something that's going to clear up in a few days. Tepe, did you bring this one in? How are things on the front line? <laughs> well, the enemy are much stronger than we could have imagined, but we're holding our own. I've been right in the thick of it. At one point, there were a horde of enemy troops surging towards us like the tide. But I didn't flinch. I drew my blade and charged straight into the fray. Four shogunate samurai, and only one of me. But I still managed to fend them off. 
Look at you. When did you grow nerves of steel? This guy stole the show, though. When he saw me tiring and falling back, he burst onto the scene and what? took down a whole group of them in one fell swoop. Are you? They were are no you? match for him at all. Are you? I are heard you? he even stormed the vision hunt ceremony, and that the Raiden Shogun herself failed to take him down. Huh? Genshin refuses to ever stream it. It just says black screen. Huh? Uh oh. Have I been up? Oh. Well, I wanted an extra hour to play Genshin. Most of the time was wasted on Ionia's quest. No fun being good. Amazing work, both of you. Um, are Still, you streaming on a PC? Uh, I can believe most of that, but him facing off against the Raiden Shogun? I think you might be embellishing the story a little there, Tepe. I mean, we've all heard of the Muso no Hitotachi, right? <sighs> One screen or two? Either way, to tell the truth, with all the losses we've sustained recently, I was starting to lose hope in our ability to hold out much longer. But seeing fresh recruits join our ranks and hearing Tepe's exploits, I'm itching to get myself better as soon as possible so I can get back out on the front line. I'm gonna go on. Huh. That's a lukewarm epiphany if Just you Just put ask it under me. game uh, well, capture you're lying there itching and to choose get Genshin better. while it's open. I'm still out there training. There should be a drop down menu or something. My injury. Oh, even though it burst it open work. again yesterday. And put it on it the did? front. Well, do there you might need be me to get you something it. to dress it with? I heard about a remedy recently that uses wild bugs. All you need to do is grind only no, with powder I mean, and it makes a very effective dressing. You choose a source on your OBS, cool on the skin choose game capture, fast to and then choose cure flesh wounds. Sure, I'll take one. Thanks. Hmm, sounds a little strange to me. I would have thought wolf hooks would do the trick, but it's your decision. It doesn't work. Try making a new scene and try it there. Maybe it's the scene that's acting weird. Because I know there's something wrong with my scene where, like, I had to re-add game capture stuff because I don't know where it went. It's kind of, like, overly complicated with all the stuff and setup. But I did make a new scene and try that again. If not, do screen capture. But you got to be careful because you might get, if you have Discord open, uh, you might get notifications pop up if your Discord doesn't automatically go into streamer mode. So I'd say just plain uh, stream your screen. And just be careful if you're not if you're not getting any other um, help from uh, doing the game capture. Well, how about we let our new recruit decide? I'll stay because I, I use it the way it's normally intended, and it's of fine. Weird and wonderful remedies. Please gather some Oni Kabuto for me. I'll take it from there. But if you're more of a wolf hook advocate, bring some of those instead. Personally, I recommend we try the new remedy. It sounds promising. I would get banned if you share your screen. <laughs> well, I mean, that'll be the only option. I mean, there should be no reason why it doesn't work. Also, what time is it? Ah! Alrighty. So, the story's getting good. Now that we're done, like, shopping with Iomia. That was boring as hell. Um, we're gonna definitely continue the story more tomorrow with Genshin. You know, along with more Yu-Gi-Oh! fun. And more, um... Stuff like that. So please follow on my socials if you have not already. Um, I released a cute video about Barbie, which I like. It's super fun. Um, let me see which one of my friends are streaming today. But yes, I will be back on at um, 6 p.m. EST tomorrow for more Genshin. Because yes, this game still has me by uh, by the balls with the with the with the fierce death grip. Oh my god, Ranger's playing Roblox? What is he, five? <laughs> Wait, let's read him. I'm out for oh work life god. balance. Thank you, no, thank you for being here. And for, I hope you enjoy your nuggies. Thank you, everybody who came in. Thank you so, so much, everyone. Um, let me see, what should the raid message be? Are you five? There we are. That's gonna be the. I know, I forget raid messages when I say these things. Thank you for the love. If you have any other questions, I'll be available tomorrow. Do you ask again during stream tomorrow? Um, I'm more than happy to answer any rate, any rate, not rate, any questions. I ain't a gatekeeper. I'm willing to share. Now, anyway, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Have a great one and bye bye.